Fuck yeah. Yeah, dude. What is this? Old? This game looks old. What? This can't be old. It's like playing on PlayStation 5. <laughs> <laughs> this game is... How many years old is it? Uh, what was it? 90, 98? 96? 26 years old? 24 years old? It's older than me. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. No? 24, 26 years old. Yeah, 1998. Wow. Are we watching the cutscenes? Yeah, we are. That's fine. I love the the like the the music in this game. It's like weird and like spooky and kind of it's kind of haunting. It's haunting. It's eerie. There's like a reverb over the whole entire game. Yeah, almost. And it makes it really ah, uh, it's it's cool. It makes it makes a really cool vibe. I love also wobbly PS1 graphics. Yeah, what's so stupid is people are like, oh, the Master Collection sucks because they didn't do anything. And it's like, Honestly, that's and? the best way to do it. Yeah, like... Because this is the truest form of the game. Not only is it that, but it gives you, like, all the fucking different regional releases of the game, too. Yeah, I think... so sick. I think... Yeah, I'd like... I'd rather... I'd rather just have the game than have... A, like... I mean, I guess it's okay if you have, like... A bunch of upgrades, mm -hmm. like oh, you can do 4K 60 FPS. Yeah, but honestly, I don't give a shit about that. Yeah, that's for 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 some for a, you don't need that for a PS1 game. Dude. I guess for two and three it makes sense, but like th th it doesn't make it that much of a difference. No. Yeah. I love a. Uh, this is a pretty common thing for performances, voice acting or otherwise, but like, the earliest rendition of a character is usually like more subdued and isn't played into as much. Yeah. You know? So he he isn't doing the like, things as much as he does in later games. And yeah. And not that I like one more than the other, it's just that I like that they're different. I like this take. It's very humble. Yeah. Humble beginnings. Yeah. There are six members of Foxhound involved in this terrorist activity. Psycho Mathis, with his powerful psychic ability. I don't think you can call him that anymore. <laughs> Wolf, the beautiful and deadly shark. Um, you don't want to call him that. It's hot and sensitive. Master of Disguise. Vault Master of Disguise starring Dana Carter. <laughs> Might not turtle enough for the turtle club. <laughs> <laughs> we need to get that one out of the way. Formidable. <laughs> See, we can. Uh, there's, there's a, there's a web connecting everything because um, that movie was recorded on 9/11, or that scene, that scene yeah. when he says turtle club <laughs> scene. the yeah. turtle cl infamous turtle club scene, yeah. recorded on 9/11, and MGS2 was censored because it came out like uh, two months after 9/11. Really? So it all, it all connects. How is it censored? When Arsenal Gear is like crashing into the like New York Harbor, yeah. there's a scene where it like fucking destroys and blows up a bunch of buildings. Uh -huh. So in the final version of the game, you like you see Arsenal Gear like surface, mm -hmm. and then it just flashes white, and then you're on top of Federal Hall. Like that's what it does. Oh wow, cut out a bunch. Huh? There was yeah, there's like a whole scene where you can where it just wreaks havoc, and they're like, mm, maybe let's not do that. Yeah. Um, there was supposed to be a scene at the beginning of that game where you're escaping from the tanker as it's sinking. Too. Oh yeah. So I don't well, know if you this, you can fuck. You can control the color of the things in the background with the joysticks. Wow. Yeah. So, truth come out, we didn't play this game until just now. Yeah. Sorry. I've not played this game once in my entire life. This is a blind playthrough. You've never played this game ever before. What are you doing? Playing Metal Gear. No, I'm just kidding. Don't care about any of that. Stupid. But I find I always I always get tripped up in this game because it has the like the inverted yeah. confirm and uh, uh, cancel. Yeah, circle and X are swapped. Which I I'm glad that they kept it at least. It's true to form. David Shader. David hates women. Hater? I hardly knew her. <laughs> it's a good one. Oh yeah, so yeah, so Christopher Fritz, I'm pretty sure, is like a pseudonym for Christopher Randolph. A lot of the names in this are uh like pseudonyms. Really? Yeah. I don't know why. Huh. And then I think of the European version of the the game. Yeah, Patrick Land, I'm pretty sure is supposed to be Patrick Zimmerman. You can take your flippers off. I know it. I'm going to swap down a couple of balls and fly. 
<laughs> God, this game, this game rules. That was, that was awesome. I'm yeah. so, I'm so excited for this. Mm -hmm. Patrick blogs. What about? What about? What, what about his blogs? <laughs> what does he blog about? Frederick with a blog. <laughs> James Flinders. James Flanders. <laughs> I did leave. I did leave. How there, Snarl's tank? <laughs> I did leave. How there, neighbor? You know. <laughs> you know, there's a band called. I don't even remember exactly what it's called, but it's called like this is snake. So one of those noises that uh, Flanders makes, and What's all the, the members are dressed as Flanders, and all the lyrics are Flanders lines. Yeah. Just as I expected. You'll have to take the oh, diddly howdy! Howdy! It's called like howdy hoodly or something. Howdy doodly. If you need to contact me by codec, the frequency is one four zero point eight five. Remember that. I guess that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it uh, saves them for you anyway, so uh, even as far back as the first one. Yeah, I like how it, change, it, cha it changes the text. <laughs> oh yeah. Snake looks so pissed over there. Dude, yeah. Shut up. Okay, I'm ready to go. He's like, shut the fuck up. Shut up, Colonel. Shut the fuck up. Oh, there's little rants. Hello, little rants. Hey, boys. <clears throat> This is the most detailed game I've ever seen. When you play this game, do you play with the D-pad or the analog stick? I like playing with the D-pad. I, I always played with the D-pad. Whoa! I didn't know you could go over yeah. go over that. I thought you just follow your doom. Yeah, I don't remember when I figured that out, but I don't know why <laughs> you would go over here. No. Oh. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Very good. Look at that chain. I was always terrible at this section. Yeah. Like I like I've. Weirdly tough. I'm not. Th I'm not that bad at this game. I yeah. wouldn't say that. I wouldn't say that I'm like an expert. But this fucking beginning room is the hardest thing I've ever played. Yeah. Oh, you can't. Sometimes. Can't in this game, I forgot. Ugh. What the heck? Why they take away features? <laughs> you want? You guys see to see the guy sneeze. <laughs> I love. I love this hyper compressed sound effects from these guys. I know. What was that noise? Look out! Ah! Let me find over here. Listen! I think <laughs> there you go. I think he sneezed. <laughs> so we we were in in the master collection. They include like the in, integral version of this game. Um, he just sneezed again. And in that in that version, um, you can you can like double double tap triangle to go in like first person mode. What the fuck? And it like stays in there. It's like a toggle for first person mode. Oh really? Yeah, it's really strange. You can play first person MGS1. It's very bizarre. Can this gosh dang elevator hurry up? Oh hurry up! Hurry up! <laughs> Do you hear something? <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could drive this forklift, it'd be awesome. You can push it. I wish I could stab that guy down there with it. <laughs> I played this game on my old channel when I was really young that I had that I uploaded like a, <laughs> like some videos to. All of them were just my iPad propped up in front of a TV screen. No way! Yeah. Oh, that's so awesome. I played this. I played Fallout Three. <laughs> a game that you love. That game that I love. I yeah. I don't know why. <laughs> did you like that game as a kid? I or tried to like it, but I did the same thing every time that I played it, which was play for like two hours and then do the same thing and then I would put it down and play Skyrim instead. I mean, hey, hey, you lasted longer than me. I tried to play New Vegas, and I lasted like maybe thirty minutes. Because it's the most boring game of all time. No. Ugh. What's he it's doing? It's the big reveal. It's the big reveal. We're playing a solid snake the whole time. <laughs> Editor, please put Raiden's face over Snake's for you. <laughs> Give him blonde hair and blue eyes. That's not Raiden. That's Wink Waste. A twist. A twist. Yeah. <laughs> that, that sounds like medieval terminology. He, yeah, was, like, he was cut to twist. Or it's not like it's not like like uh, past tense twisting. He was twist. He, he twist. He twist Whoa! his blade. Ah! Oh, cheering sound effect. Ah! No, just put actual screaming sound effects. Ah! They're, they're, they're terrified. <laughs> well, fuck this game freaks me out. Ah! I love this out outdoors. Doorsness. 
Huh. I just love the vibe of this game and the atmosphere, man. Ah, the great outdoors. So really I think atmosphere is the most important part of a fucking video game. No. I I think really shitty uh, segments are the best part of the game. I think game. quippy dialogue and funny one lines is my favorite <laughs> part of the video game. <laughs> hmm, this place is kind of cold. Mm. Cold. Colonel. Cold. <laughs> I'm in front of Wet. this <laughs> oh, Rouse. <laughs> Put up the Pro Jared bit so people know. Uh, nice and dry, but it's Remember Pro Jared? Bear with it. It's designed to prevent hypothermia. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, wait. I, I like to binge watch his videos every so often. They're very nostalgic for me. That song, dude, it hits hard. It's a good song. Like, why is it really? Why do those old YouTubers have? Such like such good theme songs. Yeah. Like, why are they actually produced really well? Yeah, the Scott the Waz out outro theme is really good too. Yeah. The the Space Hamster theme is really good. Yep. Brutal Moose never really had a theme song, did he? He no, just got opened he just, up and it went. I've not seen such bravery. Yeah. Dude, Brutal Moose is still so funny. Yeah, he is really funny. I think his stuff is probably aged the best, just because. He was he was he feels really authentic and that he's never like trying to put on an act. No, <laughs> it's he really it really just is him. Yeah, he's really dry in his delivery and stuff, but I think it I think it works. I like Brutalmus a lot. Shout out Brutalmus. Mm -hmm. Brutalmus, you're invited to come on the show. <laughs> feel free. We'd love to play uh... town with no name with you. Yeah. Guess me a drink, bartender. <laughs> <laughs> the drink slides and yeah. he, just, he just looks at it, he's he like, it, he's like, oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> I have a bunch of I have a bunch of clips from that from yeah. that game saved on my computer. <laughs> my favorite one is uh, the where he's like, you got the time, old man. <laughs> and he looks at his watch and it plays the like really fucking loud. Music <laughs> and he goes, no. <laughs> 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 what I, I think one of my favorites is when you shoot one of the main, one of the bad guys. He goes, "Oh no, I guess I'm this or I guess I'll go find no one." Nice to meet you, Snake. Oh my god! It's an honor to speak to a, a living legend. I didn't expect like a girl to be so cute. <laughs> I didn't expect you to be What's so wrong? stupid. Nothing. Didn't know anything. I expect a world class designer of military technology to be Shut so cute. Or <laughs> so. So short. Cute. Well, I know I won't be bored for the next 18 hours. <laughs> Can't believe I'm being I hit. Oh. I'm being hit by the solid snake. But uh, I'm surprised. You're so you didn't like with me. For a train killer. Looks like we No, I'm not Frank. No. About each other. no, that's yeah. the guy. That's that's Gray Fox. He was my old comrade. <laughs> and I'm not Frank. I'm Dave. Spoilers. Oh. About your soliton radar system. Oh. Skip. No. That was just a tutorial. We can skip it. Put in the put in the scene from MGS2 when they just <laughs> where Colonel literally yeah, reads off. Word. Yeah. Yes. Yes. It's all made from currently existing technology. Bullshit. I remember 2005, dude. That wasn't real at the time. <laughs> just kidding. I don't remember 2005. I was one. I was two. So, so I can. In, I, I, no, I, I can tell. I, 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 I know. Oh, you're I an know. expert. I know. <laughs> 2005 was my year. I'm pretty sure the PSP came out in 2005. I peaked in 2005. Did you? That's, that's sad, dude. I'm sorry to hear that. It's been downhill from there. Dude, I was uh, thinking about it recently. I was telling you I've been homebrewing for like PSP and 3DS and stuff. You can't admit to that. Uh, censor all that out. <laughs> and put put it instead. Put the fucking SWAT team footage <laughs> bursting down my door. Over uh, um, over me saying those words instead interspliced me saying cooking and baking for my family <laughs> a lot recently. Uh, and uh, I just miss when wow, like, awesome. when companies would put out like actual handheld consoles, you know, instead of trying to put PS3s in a handheld. Because yeah. like, I don't, I don't know, we don't need, we don't need to have like PlayStation 4 generation graphics in a, in a handheld console, you know what I mean? If you can just scale down the op and have something that you can take, like a handheld console. Here's the thing about the Switch is that I like the idea of having something that you can play on the TV and on the go, right? Yeah. But the problem with that is that it's, you're then gated by it being like a certain size and a certain form factor. 
PSP, you can slip that in your pocket. Well, like, 3DS, think, you can slip that in your pocket. You also, know what I'm saying? I also think part of the, like, not necessarily the, like, the, the, the size uh, limitations of it, but I think since you can, since you can play it on the TV, mm-hmm. people want it to be, a, like, a home console and play right. like a home console. Yeah. So, people, like, the Switch is incredibly outdated, obviously. It was when it was fucking made. Mm-hmm. But, um, it's, uh, what am I, what am I thinking? I, 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 I don't know. People are like, they're like, God, the Switch is so outdated. And it's like, well, it, it's, it's like, I don't, I don't know. That was kind of the, the, what they had to do in order to make it, uh, like a handheld and a home console. Yeah. Overall, I like the Switch. Um, and I think it is a good console in my opinion. Controversial opinion, I don't know. <laughs> but uh, like, I do. No one likes that thing, dude. I, I just miss when uh, I'm full on rations. I need that shit. Um, I just miss when like the PSP. It's so simple. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like it. It's it. All it is is it's like it's it basically go, as powerful go, go. as a PS One. Right. And it fits in your pocket. You know. I like you could. Hey, you oh. could have something that's like the power of a PS2 and make it fit in your pocket. The power of a PS2 in the in, palm in the of my day. hand. In the palm of my hand. Yeah. And that, what is that, Stong? I don't fucking it should, remember. It's supposed to tell me. Um, I'm sorry. Uh, what was I saying? I don't know, something about Stung. Oh, yeah, well, people put, people make like little handheld consoles that like run all 156 PS2 games or whatever, you know what I mean? Yeah. And they're pretty small. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Have you seen like the, the, the like the portable GameCube or something? I think I've seen stuff like it. It's like, it's like a clamshell. Kind of looks like a yeah. Uh, <laughs> this was that was the same method of entry we you used in MGS Four. Was it really? <laughs> yeah. I think I've probably just done that a million times. It's just the way that I do it now. You know what I mean? I've never I've never done it that way. Really? Do you go upstairs every time? I've always gone upstairs. I'm not supposed to be going this way. There's our radians. So this is the bulk of the gameplay. <laughs> <laughs> Good callback. Uh, I love zooming in. <laughs> well, like the, like the thing is, we we played MGS2 first on the channel, but like MGS2 wasn't my first exposure to playing Metal Gear. Yeah. I tr- I did I did get decently far in MGS1, um, <laughs> and. And while all the while you were you were you were watching me, you were, you were giving me all these funny little funny little quips. You're like, "This is the bulk of the gameplay." Yeah. I'm just crawling through, fucking. Um, yeah. This is Master, we, this is Master Miller. Did we make that line when we played MGS2? Nah. Oh shit. I spaced that. That's who? Camp Bell. That guy who, that I'm talking to? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. So that's Master Master Campbell. No, oh, I see. Alexander C- Campbell. <laughs> Bell. <laughs> Snake invented this technology that we can use to communicate. My frequency is one four. I call it the Campbell phone. Those mice are Alaska. You know, you know what I just thought. You were we were making fun of the the people saying their codec number when we can see it on the screen. Yeah. Fucking can't, Snake can't see it. So he doesn't know where he's getting called from. Well, how does he know what frequency he's tapping into? There's got to be a way for him to do it. You know what I mean? He just thinks about it. He just thinks that the frequency. Yeah. Well, I I was just saying that I meant like, like once you, uh, I'll show you in a sec. But it gives you a list of those of frequencies that you've called and that have called you. Well, this is clearly not what Snake is seeing. Right. So. So does Snake just have to write down them or memorize them? What yes, is what yes. is this screen in Snake's mind? I don't know. <laughs> you know what I mean? This is inside Snake's head. Yeah. Where'd they go? Can they swim? Can mice swim? I don't see why not, but I don't think they try to. I think they try to avoid water. I imagine. <laughs> Holy fuck! Yeah, there they are. There's so many mi- there's so many mice. So many miso. Mini miso. Mini miso. This is just like ratatouille. <laughs> no, those are rats. Oh. Big difference, I know. Yeah. What is the difference between mouse, mouses, and my and rats? Mice and rats. 
Rats are bigger. They got uglier rats, tails. Rats are bigger and disgusting. Yeah, it's basically the same between like cra cravens and rows. Oh, I don't think I've ever gone this way. You're you're a little you're a little adventurer, aren't you? <laughs> you're getting all the shortcuts. Yeah, I've played so much of this game, dude. Use the elevator. No shit, dude. <laughs> <laughs> no, I press circle. Yo, motherfuck. Oh. No! Oh, bogus. Uh, I bumped into him too, oh, too quickly. Oh, bo bog nuggets. Oh, bog nuggets. Oh, fuck. You, you, have, you have so little HP. Yeah. And... What was he doing? Did you see him? Oh, he's he's just... flapping his shit back and forth. <laughs> he's trying to fly. First death. Do you want to go off per base per death? Sure, sure. Yeah. Michael takes the wheel. Michael takes the wheel. Um, put up Michael in the top right corner. That's how we know. And yeah, put, yeah. And put uh, Bobby Lashley's face in the top left when I'm playing. That's how, <laughs> that's how we know it's playing. Not fucking answering that. Oh, this oh, is geez. this is kind of disorienting being down here. Yeah. Like, like I'm I'm so used to just going the like the the one way. <laughs> yeah. You know. You never on this floor, huh? Unless you're using the elevator. The, the yeah. The smell um, elevator. There's a. There was this VR game that I played called Pavlov VR. That was essentially just VR Counter Strike. Um, oh yeah. But you could download uh, custom maps, like community maps, and someone put get out someone yet. put Shadow Moses in the game. That's awesome. And you could get a SOCOM with suppressor, and I did, and I snuck around. It was so fucking cool. <laughs> there weren't any bad guys, but wait, there's a th there's a thingy up here, right? Mm -hmm. I gotta get the thingy. Look out! Don't don't get speeded. Don't get spotted. Don't get spotted. You might want to go up a little bit too because he might see you. There you go. You're good there. Don't get spotted. Don't get spotted. I'm not gonna get. Oh, I'm go, not gonna go, get spotted. Go, go, go. Oh, you're gonna get spotted. Wait, hold on. I thought there was a door right there. Oh. <laughs> what? No way. Wait. How does that work? Wait, I'm so confused. Why? Why is my like? What? Wait. What the? What the fuck? What? Where am I? What do you mean? I I am so confused. I'm so lost. How? Wait, how do you normally get in here? Wait, you come up from up there, right? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's on the other side. See, it's over there. You see, wait, oh! Go back. Wait, wait First what? person. It's on the left. You see that ladder? You That's where you... Down from that ladder. Got it. That's why I'm so confused. Because yeah. I, I, don't, I don't know if you I've ever floor, huh? been on that side. Hmm. I just like... Okay, whatever. Anyway. <laughs> you uh, gotta get down somehow, too. Fucking Brainazoid plays video game for the first time. Michael Brainazoid, last name. I don't want to- I, I, I didn't want to dox you or anything. It's okay. Careful. Careful! Oh, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it! Fuck! You got the Thurmg. Yes, my Thurmg! <laughs> Colonel. Oh, I'm gonna Thurmg! Colonel, I'm gonna Thurmg! <laughs> you were Thurmg, IRL. I mean, I don't try to, but sometimes it just happens, man. <laughs> and like, if you therm on accident, like, there's nothing to be ashamed of. That's yeah, like, it's not that bad. It happens to everybody. <laughs> <laughs> no reason therm. Stare, yeah, stare the the camera dead in the eye. I can't do that, Dave. I'm okay, Dave. <laughs> I'm okay, Dave. Go! I think every game needs a King of the Hill mod. I agree. Just to replace all the voices with King of the Hill. I'm okay, Dad. Dad. Oracle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay, Snake. Careful. Go away. I want to press up against that other wall. Go okay. away. <laughs> Check this out. <laughs> What's your clicks per second, Michael? Zero. <laughs> I can't. <Click. laughs> I can't. Do you want to be two? Uh, be too many fucking dumb catchphrases that we say. What's our catchphrase? Wait. Yeah, oh, I, went, I went the wrong way. We need, yeah, we need. Yeah, we need a catchphrase. Um. Hmm. <clears throat> Don't buy any unripe bananas. Oh, son of a bitch! You won't live long enough to eat them. <laughs> is that is that from something or did you actually yeah, make no, that that's, up? Yeah, no, that's a Macho Man line. I, I, I stole that. 
Ah, yes, the the spluga blah blah blah. What do you think it's like that? It's trying to tell me. It's trying to tell you there's a big green there's a big fart cloud over there. Snake, be careful, there's a big fly blah 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 blah. Do you know about the thing with Meryl here? If you go in and out this vent a bunch of times. Do you have to do it like six times or something? Something like that. Like four times. I think on the fourth time. She bugs. Hello? Oh! Oh! Ugh, kinda damn cold. I hate Alaska. Boy, oh boy, that woman is built alright. Oh. Those maggots on the Yeah, that's fucking Jesus, disgusting. Dude. No flush, no wipe. <laughs> He didn't even put his pants up, he was just shitting directly into his pants. <laughs> He's walking around with, with mud butt all day. <laughs> mud butt. <laughs> I think that's the first time I've ever heard that. <laughs> yeah. Dude, I got mud butt. You filthy mud butt. <laughs> there's, a, there's a Dave Chappelle bit uh, about the itis. Have you ever heard of the itis? I don't know. You get, it's like a thing me. that you get where like... It's like po post like Thanksgiving meal generally, or like some sort of big dinner. You get and you're having trouble sleeping at night, and you just need a little bit more food. It's the itis when you can't get to, get to sleep, so you get so he uh, has emergency ribs behind glass. He eats <laughs> in case of itis, and then he goes uh, he goes to bed after he eats eats the ribs, and then uh, he farts in his bed and he goes mud butt mud butt <laughs> mud butt. Should we do the Meryl thing or? <laughs> I'm already, I'm yeah. already, I'm already going back. So yeah, you're already going back. <gasps> Censor that. Achievement unlocked. I wish. Achie <laughs> <laughs> huh? What? What? Um, what is this? Colonel, who is this guy? Colonel. <laughs> Colonel, um, can you remind me quick? He thinks Snake uses Reddit. <gasps> no. No. I think Raiden would use Reddit Raiden though. Raiden probably uses Fortune. Raiden, yeah. Raiden uses 4chan, uh, Otacon Snakes. uses Reddit. Otacon uses Reddit, Snake's, Snake Don't reads know, books. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> what a fucking old hag. <laughs> I got I got called old for saying foolish. <laughs> the other day. That's so brutal. Yeah, I said, I said, oh, but I was like, I said, I did something foolish and the other person was like, what are you, fucking 60? <laughs> I'm like, come on. Oh, that's so mean. In that case, hurry up and get me out of here. Slow down. Don't it's worry. the it's um Peter Stillman. Yeah, I forgot that that's the same guy that voices Peter Stillman. Really Steeter Pillman. Steeter Pillman. <laughs> What's up, Steeter? Steeter Pillman. Steeter Pillman Jr. Michael put up Brian Pillman doing uh is it possible? Drop kick. Okay. <laughs> I don't remember he I don't remember what he did, but he was cool. Is she supposed to be back dressed in the cutscene? Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. Oh, maybe, I don't know. I don't remember. Um, I know that there's another cutscene where she might can have her pants off. That's when you chase her into the bathroom yeah, really fast, right? she has I don't know how the fuck you do that. You just have to be on her heels the whole time, I guess. Because you just have to know, you have to like start running kind of like right as like a millisecond she sees you. Yeah. His face kind of looks weird. <laughs> Uh, buddy, your mouth isn't moving when you're talking. <laughs> Wait a well, minute. Neither is yours. You decoy. Metal Gear. You can't Metal, Metal Gear. He said it! He said it! The first utterance. <laughs> Metal Gear is one of the most secret black projects. Why the project gotta be black? <laughs> can't because I'm black, right? <laughs> We've had a couple of run-ins in the past. So that's oh, Rex is so cool. Disposal site. I'm thinking about... Why else would I come to a Man, I hope that they put... Uh, for and the Master Collection Volume Two because um, I want you to experience that fucking Metal Gear fight for yourself <laughs> because so the the game turned sixteen recently, right? Yeah, yeah, and uh, um, people were posting clips on it and just kind of reminiscing, and I saw an, a clip of that Metal Gear fight or like the introduction to it, like when they're when they first the, the two gears come to each other <laughs> and yeah. man it's the fucking coolest thing it is so sick and I think it's particularly sick because it's the only time in, in a, the, the series that is named after and built upon these giant max called Metal Gears 
it's the only time where you actually get to take control of one yeah like for yourself and i think that makes oh my it God, feel really special me. and i think four being uh like the the end of the story it's like so it just lines up so perfectly you know it's yeah. like such a fucking full circle come together moment isn't snake on the fucking ceiling in the twin snakes yeah <laughs> in the scene yeah so it pans over and you think he's gonna be on the standing to the side and then it, sh- <laughs> up and it has a dramatic ceiling. sound effect and he's like <laughs> spider climbed onto the ceiling oh my god yeah. that game is it's like it's, it's ridiculously funny yeah yes baker knows one what the hell who the hell? Oh, that's what he says. Who the hell? There's a fucking big action anime fight with that's Gray Fox. <laughs> Each of us needs to input our past. And all the models in that game look sickly and gaunt. But <laughs> they really did. Yeah. Hadakan was especially Gaunt's gross. Gaunt's yeah. You just go, oh. oh. You would go, oh. <laughs> and fall over on himself. Like trip and fall. PM's fucking pants like a loser. One of the members of Foxhound. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Do you think those are like pineapples on his tie? <laughs> <laughs> what a shitty tie! Why would you wear that? I just a pink have... tie with pineapples. Come on, that's that's a nice tie. If they find you can make it work. Password. I think it's funny that he has that though. Yes. What's it supposed to be? I don't know. Can we find some like like yeah? Concept find, art? find some concept art of of uh, Darnold Dar- Darnold Arnderson. Donald Anderson. Anderson. Even without the past Problem is, you're gonna get, the you're gonna get, uh... And I looked it up and I got this. That's Donald Duck. Oh, fuck, sorry. <laughs> anyway, what were you saying? Maybe look up DARPA Chief. You'll probably get better. That's not... That's not him! That's AI generated. Fucking, this, what is going on? <laughs> what is that? Okay. <laughs> You're playing the clarinet. This, 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 this Donald playing Klezmer. Donald Anderson right there. Going. Somewhere in the second floor basement. I don't know. I can't tell. Dude, this fucking art rules. Look up. Look at him. Look him up in uh in Twin Snakes. Look up Dark Two Twin Snakes. Maybe it'll be. Uh, I like how we just know this game so well that we just don't even have to pay attention to it. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. It's just fucking polka dots. Or yeah, not squares. squares. What? Come what on. Did they're not even little watermelons. <laughs> looks fucking disgusting. <laughs> anyway. He looks like a punch out <laughs> character. <laughs> <laughs> we should put punch out. <laughs> I'm so bad at punch out. Uh, I am too, but I love that game. <laughs> Great theme. You out of here. That game has an awesome theme. He's gonna touch his cock. Yeah. He's pointing at it. Who's there? Who's that? Have you? From your bosses or anyone? No. I like his pi- his pineapple tie. I want one. <laughs> <laughs> that is the that is the official lore. That is a pineapple tie. <laughs> I just love that. Like he's in this situation. He's like in prison and gonna die, and he's wearing a pineapple tie. <laughs> that was a good rhyme. Yeah. <laughs> It goes an extra step because Decoy Octopus went as far as to put pineapples on the top. <laughs> hey, don't spoil it. This is, oh, yeah, this sorry. is the real Darpa Chief having a heart attack. Happening a heart attack. A heart attack. The heart that attacked <laughs> was from the Decoy Octopus. The infection that killed his body. Came from Fox Die. <laughs> the infection that hurt his body came from his gilder. <laughs> we watched like all three of those movies yeah. in between the last time we recorded and now. And, um. Basically. Listen, we watched Spider Man 3. People say that's a terrible movie. That movie fucking rules. Movie I, don't care, I don't care what you say. That movie's great, bro. It's dumb as hell, but yeah, it's great. You want me to believe that you're in charge of this op, but you don't have complete access to the file? I told Spider-Man, he goes, I'm going to put some dirt in your house. <laughs> so good. It's a great Oh, line. little Goblin Jr. He's going to cry. <laughs> goblin Jr. Get out of there. He calls him Goblin Jr. <laughs> That's so goofy. I love, I love good riddance. <laughs> 
Huh. I don't... Ready? Wait, do you hear that? What's going on out there? Wait, hold on. Uh, hello? Jeez. <gasps> oh, oh, I heard that your bowels were when you die. Can you check? <laughs> Let me hello. out. Hey. Hello? Um, hello? Hmm? Whoa. Oh, ho, ho. The door opened on its own. What? Who's, who's there? Me? Don't move. Whoa. Uh, oh, he's got undies on? Yeah, they censored it. Come on. It was already censored. <laughs> <laughs> Take his undies off! <laughs> Editor, take his undies off. <laughs> Google, take off this guy's underwear. Liquid? Oh. No, you're not. Don't move. I guarantee you in the next couple of months, we're probably gonna have, like, voice <laughs> AI detection where you can just say, Okay, Google, uh, make an AI picture of a man with no pants on. <laughs> yeah. And it'll do it. Careful. I'm no do you think brother. that... So you're Solid Snake green. and Liquid Snake, right? Glance. Yeah. You think? I, you said, "Hey Google," and you set my phone off. <laughs> uh, do you think that um, Solid Snake is consciously constipated? Liquid Snake has diarrhea. He's got IBS. Well, so the thing is, in this in this game, like he smuggled in his cigarettes with like the injections that they gave him. Yeah. The, like the nano machines. Yeah. I think? They suppressed his stomach acids. Yeah. So, do you think that like fucked up his bowels for the rest of the mission? Yeah, when do you think his stomach acid re reactivates? Because he eats rations. I don't know. Shoot! <laughs> I love his delivery here. Yeah. Shoot! Oh my god. Yeah, he's really yelling. He's like actually. He's not doing. He's got the, some force behind his voice. Not doing the cartoon thing that we do where you go. <gasps> he kind of does that sometimes, doesn't he? You know what's funny what? that I realized recently is that David Hayter and um, what the fuck is his name Sam from Death Stranding, the guy that plays with Norman Reedus. Yeah, Norman Reedus. they look really similar. Ah! They like actually look really similar. I I never never known how to dodge that. I don't know if there is a way to. This is kind of like a thing that. Wait, kills can you, you run back into the, the the cell? No. Can't you run back? Oh no, you can't. Never mind. We're about to see a very important thing right here. This is important, so be sure this to look. Very fucking important. Pay attention. Well, clearly, it, clearly, I didn't think it was important the first time I played this. Yeah. Because I fucking. Why would you? <laughs> Why would you? Right? I don't know. I, I I don't know. It's not. That's not nearly clear enough. You wiggle your butt too much. <laughs> You've killed him. I'm sorry, sir. Fool. How did Liquid get so much power? Like, how does he? How is he in this position? He can make a lot of money with the mil with the military. It's true. Well, I guess they do give him some context in Five, where he's like a child soldier. So maybe I don't know. Maybe he got to start there somehow. He made money. He sold oh, money with Sahel Anthropus, and then lost it. You think that's what happened? Who is that, knows? Is that your fan theory? Who knows? The game's incomplete. Yeah, fucking right. The game's incomplete. Yeah. It's fucking a million hours long. Yeah. Good girl. Just like that. Yeah. I didn't 100% that game, but I did like. I think my save is like it's like 93, 94%. Really? I did a lot. Holy shit! That's more than I ever did. Um. Naomi, I just had some kind of but. Yeah, that was like my save is like 120 hours or something in MGS5. Wow, I, I love that game. Psychomantis. He's some kind of psychic mantis. So that was mantis. No, he's a psychokinesis. I wish I I wish I was um, older when like YouTube was in its infancy. Yeah, you know, so you like. You know, I, I we 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 grew up with YouTube, right? Mm -hmm. Like YouTube came out when we were before we were fucking five years old, mm -hmm. basically. Um, but we had it. We, we watched it. We were we were there. We watched it. I still do, honestly. Um, <laughs> I do watch YouTube. Yep. Um, no smoking. No smoking. Whoa. 
Snakes oh. breaking the rules. C4, I don't think that'll be important. C4. C4 what? C4 C4 butts. What's the C stand for? <laughs> uh composite. <laughs> or whatever it is. <laughs> Fuck off, no it's not. You lie! lie. Where's the word? Who takes the pictures of Spider-Man? <laughs> I don't know. He sends them in the mail. You lie! <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Spider-Man, I, I know you weren't coach. Or whatever he says. I want Spider-Man! <laughs> I wish they would have kept that scene in 3 where he, uh, or 2 where he, he wears the suit. <laughs> Um, well, that's just because I I didn't have the, like the extended version. Oh, it's extended. Yeah. Uh, I thought it was just deleted. It's like it's like Spider-Man 2.1. Whoa. That's not the right one, is it? Oh no, it is. Good deeds. Well done. Good job. Good job. I was a fucking I was a dingus. Yeah. And I the first time I played this game and I used too many C4s on the room before and I think you <laughs> literally fuck yourself over if you do that. Do you really? I think so because I don't think this game gives you any more C4, like in this in this area. I think if you leave and then come back, it'll they'll respawn. I swear I tried that and it didn't work. Hmm. I am also just bad at games, so <laughs> that's okay. I keep pressing the wrong fucking button. <laughs> I like that punches detonate for some reason. Uh, these these games controls are like you get used to them, but yeah. they are just very weird. Yeah. Oh. oh too late. <laughs> Careful. It's the fat guy. He's coming, dude. <laughs> dude, I didn't even I didn't even like touch you or anything. Oh, like, what the hell? I'm here to save. <laughs> I've been about to bomb. Don't I've been touch about it. To... <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna blow. I always thought that looked so cool when he shot at his feet and he like left back like that. This, this game is very, this very game is like not anime but also very anime at the same mm -hmm. time. It's just action. It's cool. Kojima just made a game based, that was inspired by all his favorite Ball movies. Oh, the Ocelot. Yeah, Kojima's very, he's a very creative, but also very inspired guy. Yeah. I've been waiting for you, Solid Snake. <laughs> now we'll see if the man can live up to the legend. I love that he, like, I, I love that, like, from the beginning, he's just fucking sp spun the gun so many yeah. times. Six bullets. He's so vain. See the bullets. Now I'll show you why they call me Revolver. Oh, good, because <laughs> I was kind of confused about that. Yeah, I didn't really get it, but what's he doing? Draw! Ah! Oh, <laughs> shot in the head. <laughs> what the oh. fuck? What the fuck are you aiming at, dumbass? You aiming at Baker? <laughs> I love that his ow! I love that his bullets ricochet. Yeah. Oh yeah, I did shoot Baker on accident. This is my bad. Oh shit! Oops! You I just almost did it again. Yeah. I'm alive again. Come here. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna throw dirt in your eyes. Whoa, Come Baker! Ow, fuck. Yeah, equip them rations. I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Oh god. I've never been very good at this boss fight. Fuck, shoot him. Um, I think for me the trick always was just, you gotta just like assume where he is and then just fire even if you can't see him. <laughs> Whoa, back here. No! Oh! Ow, fuck. This song is so fucking good, dude. I love the smell of cordat. <laughs> Thank you. Smell of what? Smell of cordat. That boy ain't right. That boy ain't cordat. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Go, bitch. This is the greatest handgun ever made. <laughs> and then he gets fucking. He gets shit pushed in, dude. 
Eh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> He's so close. Oh, oh my god, look at the waveform with that. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Editor, sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, dude. What? <laughs> I love that in uh, in Twin Snakes. He, his hand gets cut off, and he goes. He just looks at it. He looks he's at like, it and he goes. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Look at yeah, that. His wave voice kind of cracks. It's crazy. <laughs> he just picks up his hand. <laughs> like, like, why Why is that your solution? It's like, oh, my hand just got chopped off. Let me pick it up and bring it with me. <laughs> I love that... Put it, it back on. Yeah, I love that his hand was still holding the gun. That, that exoskeleton. exoskeleton! Gray Fox does have an awesome design, too. Cla like, classic. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> oh. How do I have a suppressor in, or, uh, yeah, a suppressor oh, yeah. in this, this cutscene? I don't think you can get it yet. I'm pretty sure you can, I think there's a way. There's a way. I think if you, <laughs> <laughs> if you get that key card and then go back upstairs, you can open one of the doors and I think that's where you get it. Oh, yeah. Who are you? I mean, you can, like, you, like, I think you're intended to go grab it when you're going, because you go back up anyway, right? Yeah. Oh, I get it. Jim sent you. Oh, yeah, this is you're from the Pentagon. <laughs> yeah, this is a, what about this is a long one. Yeah. There's no time. I, I talked. Just shit my pants. Now the terrorists oh, I did it again. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Just hear bubbling inside of him. <laughs> That's fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> That's the one. Finally, we did it. We got to the shit part. Yes, yes. It did take a while. Fifty-two minutes. Yeah, about it. Yeah. Good job. Good job, us. Good job, us. Can you put when we get to the shit part, make the shit jokes? Please put applause sound effects, clapping, cheering. Put a laugh track. Put thunderous applause. Put it. Put it in like a like a theater and just like having people <laughs> applauding yeah, yes! standing up and everything standing up fucking throwing their popcorn into the air the next time that we make shit joke please have people standing up booing thumbs down <laughs> throwing popcorn throwing tomatoes all that stuff but don't include the don't include us saying that right now so it's you know it's uh so it comes from nowhere. Yeah. Next time. Yeah. What's wrong with you? Yeah, but don't cut the footage. Just cut the audio right here, so we're not saying anything in the, the, the <laughs> just screen. Is just the game is just playing. It looks like we're just looking at it. Heart attack. Oh, don't be a fool. Anyway, the terrorists have both codes now. No. Uh, damn it. Totally insane. They wouldn't hesitate. Kind of turtleneck. I agree. But what not like my nut turtle neck over the turtle. <laughs> <laughs> Not not like turtleneck like the, the clothing, but like turtleneck like his weird like skin. Oh like, yeah, he does kind of look like a turtle. Yeah. I'm not gonna let these maniacs start a war today. You still have the car keys. Car keys. Car keys. I heard you. I don't have the car keys. No, not left, I think I left them in the car. My car. Yeah. I can't drive. They're like teasing you with this level four door, like right next to you. Yeah. It's like you want to go in here, but you can't. You have to remember that it's here, so you can come back. No! Which is the beauty of this game is that you can't come back. I mean, it forces you to at other points, but that's also like, it also lets you explore yeah. other parts that you don't need to. Yeah, you're rewarded for remembering that there's doors like this back here. I do wish this game had more stuff. Yeah, it is a, it's a brisk, brisk game, very quick. And it just, re it just recycles a lot of the same stuff too, so no. it's, it's like, I don't know. That's where that's where it gets a lot of its length in the latter half. What frequency was she at? Oh yeah. Let me tell you. Huh? Oh. Sorry. I forgot. What? Fuck you. Oh, that's right. It should be on the back of the seat. Michael, go get it. Whoa. He leapt up out of his seat and flew into the air like a superhero. Whoa! He launched it at my face and broke my nose. <laughs> Found it. Where is it? Yeah, that's right. There, there. Uh -oh. 
What does it say? It says the original stealth action series returns. Oh. How do you wait? What? what? Wait, maybe it's on the inside. You said. He, 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 oh, oh! I bet it's a code. It's in there. Oh yeah. Yeah, you gotta unlock it. Oh, there you go. It's at the top there. Oh, cool. It expires on November first, twenty ninety nine. Can someone test this out? Can someone? Can someone watching this video in the year twenty ninety nine please test if our our access code works? We're going to release what code it is. We're going to schedule a release for it via tweet deck on the year 2099. <laughs> it's going to be on your Twitter. Yeah, it'll be fine. Be sure to follow me at, at LOLDAE underscore SU. I tweet about wrestling. <laughs> That's it. I'm jealous they have a physical copy of this game. Yeah. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. Got snake and snake and riding and snake. No, that is not solid snake. No, not solid snake. There's a funny bit on Twitter that people will do where whenever somebody is talking about Metal Gear and they're like, solid snake, blah, 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 but they use a photo of Big Boss. Like a million people will reply with that screenshot of Snake and Tewing goes, no, that is not solid snake. No. Yeah. What are they talking about? Uh, they're talking about missiles and whatnot. Whoa. Whoa, I like missiles. I like missiles, that's just cool. Missiles are cool. Freaking scary. Yeah. I would hate to get blown up by a missile. <laughs> you think getting blown up sucks? <laughs> if your brain gets, like, like blown up first, right, it'd probably be fine. Well, I mean, yeah, because you probably wouldn't, you probably wouldn't feel that. Right, because if you if you got shot in the head, your fucking brain explodes. Yeah, there, I I think that how fast do fucking signals move in our in our in your nervous system? It's like like nanoseconds. It's like it's like it's basically like the speed of light. Basically, is it really? It's like it's wicked fast. Um, because like apparently like I think we talked about this, but like the guys, those rich people in that Titanic submarine thing. Titanic submarine explorer. Oh yeah, they apparently the pressure crushed the thing so quickly that they were like they wouldn't have even known that it happened. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. How far was that thing down? I don't know. It didn't reach the Titanic as far as I know. <laughs> and uh, like yeah, apparently like suck. a plane, like f the people in the plane in 9/11, like. Business. Didn't even realize that it crashed. Like it was moving so fast. Like people. Well, because they. Plan. Well, because they just got incinerated right away. Yeah. Well, a plane moving at full speed in order to go its own distance, technically, right? Like think about how many planes distance per second it's moving. If it's like five thousand miles per hour. Yeah. Right. Wicked fast. Yeah. Hey. He's got a Lincoln Park album burning on the CD. <laughs> Um, every every like every few years, I kind of go down a rabbit hole mm -hmm. uh, on specifically on 9/11. They always show 9/11 documentaries, <laughs> but there was there was one documentary that I found that we also happened to watch like in school. Yeah. Um, like one time when I was in when I was in high school. Yeah. And, it, and that documentary had like footage of the first plane hitting the tower. Oh, the first plane? Yeah. Oh wow. Because like that footage like basically doesn't exist because no one fucking knew yeah. what was going on. But yeah. I think there was like there was like a there was like a like a department part of the fire department who they were doing like an on-site like thing. Yeah. Um, just like recording, like maybe making their own like short film or something. Mm -hmm. It was like these two brothers. And they both had a camera. One of the dudes is filming. They were out on the, on the street, and the dude and like, like the dude hears something. It's like, oh, there's a plane. And so he looks up, and there's a fucking giant oh. plane right there, Holy and it crashes shit. into the first tower. Wow, it's crazy, cause he's you know he's on street level too. Yeah. And so you just see the fucking big shadow go over you, and it's a plane, and it explodes into the twin tower. One of them. That's crazy. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh, I forgot. Snake is so hot, he makes these gay men have big boners so much <laughs> that they get heart attacks and die. So this guy actually had a heart attack, right? Uh I forget what I forget what his death was caused by. I don't know. I'm all Colonel, good. Are you listening? Colonel! He's dead too. I have no idea. What's his name? Kenneth me. Baker? Yeah. Look like another heart attack, but some kind of poison. Well, there are lots of drugs that yes. cause a heart attack yeah. in large doses. For example, potassium <laughs> chloride or dioxide. Suffered a sudden <laughs> heart attack as he implied the existence of his ability to fire a stealth nuke. I want you and Why can't a faker? Thank you, Reddit. Why can't a faker? Let's try that again. Uh, why are the pictures when Snake, Baker dead? I understand why Fox had his program before co Fox had his program before. Uh, like us, uh yes, I guess it's Fox Die. Baker hmm. was aware of Fox Die's development as well as the Baker could also attempt to warn Snake. I'm guessing that, that preventing that Baker from warning Snake about the whole virus, which could obviously ruin it all. I don't know. Weird. Is that right? Snake. That reference the that reference the Patriots, and I think that's I think that's interesting because the Patriots are not a thing in this game. Like there's they not? there's no there's no reference to their existence at all. Right, it, it's it not was, like it was not part oh, of the story. Shit. True, like because retroactively, I think they kind of retcon it, right? Um, like for like the events of this game, or. Yeah. Yeah, because the fucking U.S. government is involved. Wait, where's the fucking door? Where did uh, I come from? <laughs> down right there. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or there, there you uh, go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, shit, yeah, so it's just the government that they imply uses Fox Dive? It's like, it's like the head of the... Uh, the Pentagon? I don't know. Maybe it will, Well, maybe. Like, uh, yeah, they don't, they don't say... I don't think the Patriots are, like, a name that's uttered in this game. Yeah, I don't think so either. I think MGS2 the is, MGS2, low. the la la lu la lo. MGS2 kind of invented that. Yeah. Um. Oh, not that door. No. No. Do the guards go over the trapdoors? I think you can kill them with the trapdoors. Really? Um. I don't. I, I think that would be very. Yeah, he, he would have just walked over it. Ooh. Oh. Oh. That's the FAMAS, I'm pretty sure. The famous? Yeah. You FAMAS pussy. <laughs> oh, that's a that's a classic. Yeah, that's a throwback. Um Do you wanna do you wanna explain explain the story? Did, was that just what we I don't know if it had an origin outside of we were called it for using FAMAS in CSGO or something like that. Right? Yeah, I don't know I don't know what this kid's deal was, but he was so pissed that we were we were using the FAMAS in CS go. Yeah. He just kept calling us, You're a fucking FAMAS pussy. <laughs> and we we're like, What? Alright, dude. So so we just we just rolled with it and I think we started calling him a FAMAS pussy after, <laughs> after a while. Your mom has got a FAMAS pussy. Hey. Too far. <laughs> Your mom is not a FAMAS pussy. Dude, it would fucking suck to fall into a trapdoor. <laughs> what do you think is at the bottom of these trapdoors? Clearly death, because Snake dies. Yeah, he dies. What do you think kills him? Is it just a... Do you just, th just think he hits the ground, or is it like spikes? It's probably spikes. I think it's spikes. <laughs> what else would you put uh, put under a trapdoor? <laughs> he goes... What are you doing? Oh, I can't go in that door. I'm just curious. Right. So when you're playing this game, are you like looking at Snake, or are you looking at the, the, radar. the radar? Unfortunately. We turn it off. The game would be so hard without it. You famous pussy. You famous pussy. I'm pretty sure it was a 12 year old that said it too. Yeah. Was it just some guy online? I think so. Okay. It was just some dude in our lobby was so mad at us. I think my favorite my favorite memory of that that day and also that era yeah. is I was using the absolute worst uh, laptop ever. <laughs> um, I think at that point it was like. It was like three years old. Mm -hmm. it wasn't that old. Um, That's where I call Meryl, right? Mm -hmm. 140.15. One, I just knew that. Okay. And so much of this fucking video game I have embrained in my freaking brain. Embrained? Oops. Embrained. That's one four. No response. What do you think PTT stands for up there? 
paternal transmission just tra train. <laughs> okay. It's true. We can look it up. Huh? Yeah, editor, pull up the wiki page. Editor, pull up, pull up, pull up uh, wikipedia.com and look up uh, PCT. And tell me what you find. Thank you. I don't need lectures. You're just like your uncle, you know? What do you think? Do you what do you think editor found? We go way back. I was honestly thinking of putting something completely unrelated. <laughs> Could you be Snake? Are you Solid Snake? You Solid Snake? Whoa! No, snake. Calm down. Yeah. Whoa, Sorry you're a beautiful that. lady. Oh, sure you wait, a minute, you're a beautiful guys. woman? But I knew you now I'm listening. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know why I'm just going on my phone. Oh, uh, boy. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Check with the PDF for BTT, see if there are any updates. Right. <laughs> any updates? <laughs> the editor changed it. Wait, so he can so he can see her. Well, he saw them before. Oh, I guess. And he commented on them. You've got a nice butt. <laughs> oh, I don't believe that. Why did you look so surprised when you saw my face? Because you look just like him. You mean the terrorist leader, Liquid Snake? Yeah, you know him? You're not brothers, are you? I have no family. That's <laughs> awesome. What's the deal then? Who knows? What's the what deal with Liquid Snake? But first I want That's what I'm trying to figure out. You were involved in this exercise. Who was the who was the first person who made the what's what's the deal with airline food joke? It comes from Jerry Seinfeld. People attribute attribute it to Jerry Seinfeld because that was kind of his thing. He was just like, "What's the deal with blank?" Yeah. I don't think it's just a nuclear. And airline food is like the default go to. I'm pretty sure. Which fun fact? The deal with airline food is the altitude. Did you know that? Altitude makes you taste different. Fun fact, but you know. Why is why is that though? I don't know why. I'm not a no scientist. <laughs> Of What's the most scientific fact you know? I honestly I don't know if you knew this, but your co-host is a nine-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly <laughs> thought you said scientist, scientist, science scientistic. I said science. Did I say scientistic or scientific? You said scientist. No, you said scientistic. Or no, scientific. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck did you say? Say it again. I thought I said scientific. Scientific. <laughs> Um, what's the most scientific thing that I know? Yeah. Sounds kind of fishy. So what do you Um, trying to think. I'm not sure. I was captured with um, right after the revolt started. Oh yeah. That's when he gave you the dead. Think here's the thing. Cool. I don't fucking know cuz I'm not a fucking rocket scientist. Here, here's here's a question for you. Hmm. That that code thing spires 2099, right? Expires. Yeah. Do you think humans are going to be around in the year 2099? Same as the DARPA chief. Not in the form that we are right now. You think we're going to evolve? I I think so. I kind of I did a I did a uh, like a little research project on this. We were we were studying like climate change mm -hmm. and like my specific aspect of it was like. It was like global warming, yeah. like specifically researching yes. the warming of the, the earth. Yeah, um, rise in temperatures. And like the, 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 the like leading scientists at like NASA and like world.gov. <laughs> I don't remember what the other one was. Yeah, they're basically they're basically saying that um, like global like global warming, climate change, yada yada yada, is unavoidable. Yeah. We kind of can't do anything about it anymore. Yeah. We fucked ourselves in that way. Yeah. So basically, what we have to do is we have to adapt. And like the thing is, is that there might be some benefits to like the warming temperature, like longer crop seasons. That's nice. Oh. But it's also like crazy weather effects and. You know, overall, it's just not rising sea level. Yeah, like things die because yeah. of like the rising temperatures. Wet bulb temperatures. So it's like we're, we're we'll probably invent infrastructure that can handle like floods and like more resistant to probably like damaging weather yeah. events. But like we can't reverse it. I think that's mm -hmm. basically what I what we found out is that it's just like we're fucked, but we can kind of do something to mm -hmm. make it less sucky. When I thought about my oh, it's playing the emotional song. Bodies, <laughs> I hesitated. Shooting at targets and shooting at living, breathing people are different. Yeah, I think humans are gonna have tails in the year 2099. Mm -hmm. I hope so. I hope we have fucking Dragon Ball Z tails. That'd be awesome. <laughs> 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 fucking turn into giant monkeys. 
Um, do you know about wet, wet bulb temperatures? You probably do, since you researched all that shit. Wait, I, I don't know the I don't know the term wet bulb temperatures. It's like the thing where it's like it's a certain heat in a certain part of the world that like the humidity is such that humans can't perspire efficiently enough, so that if they're outside, they just cook. Oh, yeah. And it, like it's a thing that happens every year, and like we lose, and like it's mostly fine because people live in in houses with air conditioning yeah. in America. But like we end up losing like a bunch of homeless people and a bunch of old people as a result of it or something like that. Yeah. yeah. The adrenaline in your bloodstream is starting to thin out. Just take it easy. I love this song. Mm -hmm. the best is yet to come. We'll talk about it it's by like oh, now, you have Is this like, the best is yet, yet to come? Live. Yeah. I get out of here alive. I'll think about that other stuff. Now it's not. Okay. <laughs> Just switches. Let's try to say this another way. Stay the hell out of my way. He's peeled. <laughs> You're a real bastard. Just like which which before. characterization of Snake do you like the most? Like which Snake in which game do you like the most? It looks like you were hmm. right. <laughs> okay. This one's really good, and N two is really good. We'll link up after. He's a little out of order in 3, because, like, he's a weird blend of being, like, a, a cool, badass guy that's all hot and sexy and kicks ass and stuff, but also being, like, a young and experienced guy that gets his ass handed to him. Yeah, he's kind of oblivious. Yeah. Um, and then in 4, he doesn't really get a whole lot of time to actually shine. He, he barely talks in 4. Yeah. I think Five's characterization of him is kind of terrible. Yeah. Just because he isn't really a character. Mm-hmm. It's a different guy. Peace Walker's pretty interesting. Um, he has a really interesting arc in Peace Walker. Where he's, like, coming to terms with the fact that the boss is dead and that you need to kind of, like, move on. Mm -hmm. It's It's, like, Big Boss's chance to realize that you need to carve your own path and, and, and write your own meaning. Yeah. Um, which is something that, like... It's a theme of the, like the whole series. Yeah, Snake understood it, and Snake was able to teach it to Raiden. But um, Big Boss was like so headstrong and living it for the sake of the boss, kind of. Oh, get that. Is there anything? Is there anything scary in here? No. No. Okay. Fuck off. <laughs> Snake, I unlocked the cargo door for you. Thanks. Where I Where can see you. Ya. Where I can see you. <laughs> Where is that? I'm in like a secluded room right now. Yeah. She's fucking standing right behind me, breathing down my neck. Behind you. What does that mean? Whoa! Uh, nothing. Listen, Fuck snake, behind you, jackass. Like <laughs> what if instead of called Snake, he was called sensors. Jackass? Be careful. <laughs> if an intruder is it's Raiden's name. Is <laughs> jackass, yeah, that's his last okay, name, his so ass. The nuclear warhead storage building. Wait, does he have a last name? I don't think they ever say it. Doesn't Genesis Valentine call him Jack Raiden? Yeah. <laughs> Have you Sorry, played Metal Gear Rising Revenge, starring Jack Ryden? <laughs> that would be like calling this guy Dave Snake, <laughs> you know what I mean? David Snake. Dave Solid Snake. My name's Dave. I love that he says Dave, and not David. <laughs> What's for? I think yeah, you already went in that one, right? Yeah. It's worthless. That's where you got the Thurmg. Okay, sorry. Cut all this. It's worthless! Cut all this, leave it on the cutting room floor. You like that? Oh, oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah, that's alright. Just no worries. Um, sometimes I forget to react. That's fine, I get it. I'm not funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, dude. We all know you're not funny. <laughs> it's it's alright, man. Sometimes you tell jokes and they don't land. It that, just happens to all. That's just our dynamic, you know? It's like, <laughs> I'm the funny you one. <laughs> you tell jokes and I don't laugh. <laughs> <laughs> That's just our thing, dude. Yeah, bro. Oh, now I got I got the therm goggles, so I don't need the sickness. Oh. Okay. This is kind of awkward. There you go. Oh, oh. Fuck. The perspective always fucks with me. Farks with you. Don't fark with me, okay? I like how they bounce, kind of. Always look bouncy. Fucking. Oh my god. This, uh, I think I'm good. Nice. Hey, hey. Good job. First try. First try. First try. I'm a gamer. I'm a gamer. Big fat lemur. 
Put up Lizard Squad. Lizard <laughs> Squad. Put up Captain Sparkles Gagnum style. <laughs> uh, 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 can I see? Oh. oh, you can! Holy shit, I didn't know that. This kind of makes us... Ther the Thermgees are kind of... It's a little overpowered. A little, a little OP. That's a little gamer term for you. Oh, wait. What does that stand for? Um, Overprotection. Okay. Be careful. There are Claymore mines around there. Tarpa Chief? Use a mine detector. <laughs> Who are you? Just call me Deep Throat. Deep Throat. <coughs> the informer. <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> Using burst transmission. You. Did you ever watch Metal Gear Awesome? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I love when he goes, Call me Deep Throat, and then Snake goes, You. you. <laughs> <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Icky. Icky. Sneaky. Uh, I hope nothing scary. A big tank rolls up and I shoots me. I hope no big tank with a large oh, Native American man doesn't show up. Oh, oh, sorry. In Inuit. 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 Yeah. <laughs> it's the fucking coolest character in this game. Great line right here. Snakes don't belong in Alaska. <laughs> That's awesome. I will not let you pass. You shall not enter. <laughs> oh, good reference. <coughs> oh, Jesus, fuck. Whoa! <laughs> Blows up from a mine. <laughs> yeah, there was kind of claymores right there. <laughs> Chuck Farley. You should crawl yeah, on the ground like the snake you are. Hmm. Let's fight. Uh, if only I could, uh. Boop. You're gonna be blood up. I'm just kidding. No, I'm not. That's what I do. Isn't there like a weird trench thing in the Twin Snakes version of this fight? I don't recall. Oh fuck! There is a big missile in your face, though. This missile coming right, <laughs> right now. Oh, sorry. Nope. That's one of my favorite uh, funny moments in a typical cartoon show. Is when they're like, "There's a, there's a scary thing coming right now." Oh, just kidding. It's right now, and, and then it, it doesn't happen at the right time. Yeah, it's a good bit. Very funny. Here, asshole. Whoa. Whoa! Oh, I blew him up. Holy shit! Did you sink it? See how you like this. <laughs> See how you like this. See how you like this. Look how compressed that was. Yeah. I love compressed sound effects, man. I don't remember what game I was playing recently, but the sound effects were all compressed and stuff. I think it was Peace Walker, actually, on my PSP. Oh. Wait, what are this fucking? <laughs> I'm no pussy. You for boss pussy. <laughs> oh no! Get a real gun. Whoa! How the fuck did you do that? That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say? I'm just the best at this game. <laughs> that awesome walk, dude. He's so cool. I love how his like jacket is like ripped. That's crazy. What? His like. Not ripped, but like shredded, like toned muscular. Oh, yeah. Like it's molded into his like bomb jacket or whatever that is. I thought it was like a like a vest. Keep vest. Warm. Yes, vest. Vest. That's what I'm thinking. Of. He got the ultra rare Charizard card. <laughs> I was going to sell that for three thousand dollars. <laughs> he is just as you said. In battle, he is as if possessed by a demon. Much like you, I would expect no less. Huh. See? I told you so. But I will kill him. So, General Ivan, I hear he took your hand as well as your dignity. Wait, Ivan? That's his, that's his name? Um... Ivan Shalashasko? Shalashasko is a nickname. Wait. Wait. Is he... is he... Sioux tribe or is he Inuit tribe? Uh, <laughs> I think they're just kind of drawing from a general Native American type thing, even though Inuits aren't Native American. Are uh, the classic American phrase. I'm walking here. 
Ravens and video games. What do you say? What do I say? Yeah. Like they're, 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 they're very cool. I really like ravens and crows and whatnot. I think they're really neat creatures. Like big black birds? Mm hmm they're, they're really smart is the thing. Would you have a conversation with one if you could? I've been trying to make friends with a, with a raven for a while or a crow. <laughs> there was one in my backyard and I ran and I grabbed some quarters. And I was like, wait, I'll be right back. Quarters? Yeah, if you give them shiny shit. They they come back. And they fucking you. try and they they take it. They, they want take more. they give they take it and they bring you stuff. Whoa! They try to they bring you other shiny stuff. So is that is that the inspiration for the the big crow in Dark Souls? Oh maybe. It's like give me shiny yeah. or whatever, and then you give it something and that gives you sometimes cool shit. Yeah. Yeah. There's lots of boxes. Yeah. Here, but yeah. Are they all warheads? Yes. They're all dismantled warheads. They just leave them here. Like, the vocals are just so eerie, yeah. and it's one of the most unique sounds. Whatever patch that is, that synth. Yeah. I'm imagining if the synth might be a choir. Who knows? It's probably a synth choir. I doubt it's like a live recording. Yeah, yeah I, I doubt it. Um... I think an I think an interesting thing in Final Fantasy VI they have some some, tr some tracks that are like emulating emulating vocals, mm -hmm. um, uh, and you know like the the sound the sound files on that SNES were fucking tiny so you couldn't do like a yeah. vocal sample, um, like they didn't they didn't figure out how to do that for the Final Fantasy games until Final Fantasy VIII. Really. Um, yeah, all like did you did you know that all of the the sound effects and music from Final Fantasy VII are on the onboard PS1 chip? Really? Yeah. They're just being is it just being MIDI controlled? I'm guessing. Um, I I, I, uh, I don't I don't know. Yeah, but it, it it's not it's not saved on the on the game disc is what you're saying. Like it's I think basically. That's crazy. That's really cool. Um. Yeah, so, like, yeah, I don't know, that's just, that, that, Final Fantasy VII, great soundtrack. But anyway, Final Fantasy VI has, like, vocal tracks, and mm -hmm. they just sound, they sound very, very silly, you yeah. know, because, like, they, they kind of sound nowhere, nowhere close to actual vocals, like, yeah. like, yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> or they go, or if they do, like, a little vibrato thing, they're like, yeah. Go away! Oh, wait, there's a box right there. Colonel, someone put a box in my way. <laughs> Snake, go inside of it. Snake, you can use a cardboard box to hide. <laughs> this is Metal Gear, after all. This is Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Beep. Gear. Oops. Beep. Nothing here. Oh, fuck. You fool, get in. <laughs> press up, press up, press up. Hmm. You can't? Ah, that's funny. Oh, I can't I can't on that one. Okay. Whoa. Sometimes he just goes not where I direct him to. <laughs> Excuse oh. you. We still don't have the suppressor. Oh that fucking oh wait, shit. Wait, hold up. Where'd he go? What? What just happened? No way. <laughs> huh, I guess I'll go pee. Wait, put a C4 on his back. <laughs> what just happened? Don't tell me this guy pees. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that would have been so funny. Oh, I man, I gotta, I gotta that was pee. Awesome. <laughs> that dude, that dude felt something on his back. He was like, "Huh?" and then huh? immediately blew up. Don't tell me these guys got a shit. Like nothing ever happened. Yeah, we'll leave him be. The other guy had to be exterminated, though. <laughs> Do you get the Nikita? Do I need the Nikita? Yep. Yeah. Oh shit! You're right. 
I need the fucking SOCOM suppressor. That's what I need. <laughs> you don't have to shoot. Uh. It, it is really it is really satisfying to just kind of like play these games kind of with, like with your bare fists. Mm -hmm. You know, and just sneak up behind people and grab yeah. them rather yeah. than just shoot them from a million miles away. That's my favorite way to play five. Yeah. And we discussed this um, earlier in a, in a different recording session, but I fucking that's like I hated that so much about three. Yeah, that that's how you have to play that game. Yeah, is you have to snipe dudes. Yeah, because it doesn't let you play. It doesn't let you actually sneak around. Yeah. Shut up. I know. On oh, that, I'm doing. God damn it! Snake, what? Shut. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I probably shouldn't be skipping stuff, but. I just, I know. I just, I just, I just, I can't even right now. I just, <laughs> I just imminent right now. Are you imminent? I am imminent. Whoa. <laughs> I always hate. Oh, wow! I stink. <gasps> I love and I hate that it zips at a million miles an hour. Yeah. It's kind of hard on the eyes. Yeah. Look out! Look out! Oh, this is Snake. Like, cause Snake, the game on the the phone. Oh, it's yeah. How you control the Nikita? Oh, he wait. You know what I'm saying? I mean, not exactly, but only what you want. One. <laughs> Fine. Well, it's fine. I yeah. agree. It doesn't agree, but whatever. Oh, I'm really pushing it here. It's just a gun gun camera. It shouldn't be that bad, right? True. Put that shit on run, 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 right run, run, now. Run. Oh fuck. Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't stop your your O2 from going down. It's just like it just slows it. Yeah. <sighs> oh, I love that it's like a slight gradient. The the bars. Yeah. Yeah, I love how they look in in two. Mm -hmm. They look really they look really cool. And Twin Snakes borrowed it. Um. And I don't know. I like that. Yeah. Using the chafee. Yep. Using my chapped thighs. My chapped thighs. Yeah. Chapped thighs, yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's kind of the same thing, right? Where your skin is just dry, so it rubs up, rubs against this, itself, and uh, feels I, bad. I thought that chapped lips specifically were that they were dried out, and that chafing was specifically that you were rubbing it raw. I could be wrong though. Yeah, 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 yeah. You think you're right? But oh, look out! <laughs> We're goody. Goody, 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 goody. But like getting, ch but getting like chafed right. Oh, uh -oh. right on, right like right around your crotch is like the, the worst, worst thing ever. Like during the, the during the summertime when you're like out, out with your uh, your swim trunks. Yeah, you go to the, you go to the beach with your hot GF, yeah. and, it's, and it's like, oh, I'm gonna have a great time, and then you start chafing, and you're like, fuck. Yeah, it feels fucking terrible. You're like, fuck. Fuck. It's the worst thing that could possibly happen to you. I used to chase. There's nothing worse than that happening. Like yeah. I'm specifically like, saying that because there's these guys that got fucking slaughtered <laughs> right in front of us. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. I thought I thought you were talking about. Um, <laughs> Jesus. That's horrible. He's fucking scooping out his intestines yeah. and like eating them. This I was a really great moment though. Yeah. <laughs> but this this whole this gray fox boss fight. Mm -hmm. Oh, do you do you remember? Were you, were you watching me fight gray fox for the first time? Maybe. I don't recall. God, I spent so long on this boss fight. He is fight. tough. I even have trouble with him. He's Wait, hard. I know we we're gonna switch off desk, but can I fight him? Yeah. <laughs> I, actually, I actually like fighting him. Um. Um. 
but god i spent so long it was me i like i was fighting him from probably like 10 p.m to like 4 no not 4 a.m but like 2 a.m yeah just, and it's just, oh dark souls ain't shit it's auto guy do you know that streamer kai sanat no he's like i think he might be the most popular streamer on twitch right now um and uh he originally started by playing just sports games like he never played action games he never played shooter games or anything like that maybe fortnite yeah okay um and then like recently uh like a year ago i think he played dark souls 3 for the first time and Mm -hmm. um he like fell in love with him and he got really popular playing that game and he just started playing elden ring and he's been start he's been playing last i checked he went between like uh 300 deaths and 900 deaths to the final boss of the DLC. <laughs> like, all in one continuous playthrough. Okay. Yeah. It was crazy. I, I don't remember exactly the number, but um, that's what he's doing What's right with now. These guys? Yeah, it's like... like my Japanese anime. Yes! <laughs> yes! Yes! To do battle with you. What is it? Revenge? Um... <laughs> what was I just thinking of? It's totally lost my train of thought. It's okay, this guy's cool. I was gonna say, there's nothing else we more can, important than this right now, so... Can pay attention. It makes no difference. He did just piss himself. <laughs> Fine. Watch from inside there. I need that man. Keep your hands off him. Now, I love that sometimes the light like leaves a trail. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, Boy. nice dodge. He goes, ah, ah, ooh! Ah, 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 ooh. Fucking put your dialogue away, I can't grab my ration. <laughs> nice. Ooh. Is that a post reference poster? Yeah, right so right Police Knots was a game that he made, that Kojima made before Metal Gear. It's like a point and click adventure novel, visual novel thing, I think? Yeah. What a selfish man. There's a PS1 on the desk there. Where's the GameCube and Mario and Yoshi? <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Just got closed lined. <laughs> 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 Come over here. I'll kill you. <laughs> Oops. I think we were. Weren't we watching Tony play this game one time? Oh, I think so. I think he also got stuck. Yeah, he got stuck here, and then he got to the very end. And he had no rations left, and he was one hit away from dying. And, uh, um, Fox does, like, a AoE attack when he dies, like, on death. That does yeah. Damage. And I was like, get away from him, get away from him, get away from him, and then he, and then he died. I don't exactly... I don't, I don't remember how I did it the last time that mm-hmm. I, that I fought him. Um... Cause like I did, like I still don't exactly ow okay that, that was nothing I could do about that um I still don't exactly know what to do about that like there's there's a there's a time you have to wait yeah like after the explosion but it's like so unclear what that is yeah oh thanks man <laughs> oh fuck <laughs> nice oh, just in time just in time <laughs> oh. <laughs> Catch me if you can. <laughs> I don't know where that is. Yeah, I don't either. I can't find that. <laughs> um, it's lost cause. See right here. here. Oh shit! Oh. <laughs> Pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> I love his voice actor in this game, but do you know who his voice actor is in Twin Snakes? Mm, no, I forgot. He's a guy named Gary Paulson, and uh, just went back to the same spot. Gary Paulson is a great voice actor, but do you know who else he voices? Wait, isn't he Hellboy? Wait, or no, that's Ron Perlman. That's right? Ron Perlman. Uh, do you know who else Gary Paulson voices? I should know, but who? Uh, Carl Weezer. <laughs> <laughs> this is the voice of Gray Fox in Twin Snakes. More. He's so cool. Oh yeah, this shit. 
I know his game. More. <laughs> the weirdo. Yeah, so fucking fighting this guy for like four hours straight basically made me a pro. Yeah. Got it. Um. The twenty-first night of <laughs> September. <laughs> I think I'm the first person to ever make that joke. <laughs> You're fucking up. <laughs> Shut up, dude. I'm sexing. I'm. I'm <laughs> You're sexing? <laughs> no! I'm sensing some sexual tension here. <laughs> Do you think these two are lovers? Until the, the, the war? Until the war. Maybe. It's like, uh. It's like, uh, the sorrow and. It's gonna the do two? Did I know? Nice. Good job. Okay. First person. <laughs> oh. Oh. See? Like, what the fuck? Okay, I think- No! Damn it, fuck! Nope, stop! Okay. I don't know. Oh, maybe- it's he okay. does say hurt me more, doesn't he? Can you shoot him? <laughs> Wait, okay. I don't know where he- where, where'd he go? Top right. Oh, there he is. I don't know if I can kill him this way. I imagine you could. It's the circle on the ground, I think. Ba -da 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 -da. There we go. Okay. Yeah, go. yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 You're right. You're right. You're right. Okay. I'll pass it off to you. Oh, I just want. I just wanted to do that boss fight. <laughs> I do like that boss fight. It is really fun. Yeah. It's like it's it's scary. It's got a lot of tension. It's cool, I like that all the boss fights are different in this game. They're all- yeah, they're all unique. Some of them are better than others, but... You don't judge. I really wouldn't even know if there's a bad one. I, I don't really like the Rex fight that much. Really? It's- yeah. Well, the Rex fight's tough, very tough. It's- and if you- if you lose, you have to start from the very beginning. Yeah. I don't know, I think- I think the tank and the hind are kinda- Oh yeah, the they're, tank. They're, they're iffy. Jesus Christ. The sound effect is so brutal. Yeah. And it's like, I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be like a carpeted floor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's probably like cement underneath it, so yeah. he's probably smacking it so hard. Yeah. Wow. He's crying like a baby. He just fucks off. It's like, I'm gonna. Those flips. I'm out of here. Those flips and turns to dust. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, oh, fuck. Aww. We're really blasting our way through this game. Gray Fox. Gray Fox. That ninja is Gray Fox. No doubt about it. Ridiculous. You of all people should know he died in Zanzibar. No. He should have died, but he didn't. What? Oh, I'm thinking of I'm, I'm thinking of the like Fox when they do the flashback lines in MGS4 and they yeah. use the re-recorded ones. Oh well, yeah. And no, Colonel's I voice just sounds off. A predecessor, Dr. Clark, was in charge. Dr. Clark. Yes. He started the gene therapy project. He? And where is he now? Is that a retcon? Yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say, because Dr. Clark I thought was uh was paramedic. So paramedic, what about yeah. The soldier? Apparently for their test subject they decided to It's okay, Naomi, Naomi's just stupid. Unless he transitioned. <laughs> who, who knows? It's possible. But he was already dead. Yes. But they revived him. But you died! They fitted him with the prototype yes. exercise. Kept him drunk for four years while they experimented on his life. Fucking epic Reddit! Yes! <laughs> Today's genome soldiers were born from those experiments. That's the sickest thing I ever heard. Isn't that fucking cool? Dude? That's the fucking coolest thing I've ever heard. Therapy techniques. Naomi, why didn't you tell us about this sooner? Because it's confidential information. <laughs> is that the only reason? You didn't ask. The thing is, Naomi is not, like, not on your side in this game. Yeah. But she's at least likable. What's the thing about her in 4 is that she's just, she just sucks. She's just confusing. She doesn't make any sense and you don't like her because of that. She just fucks you over, but it's like, it's not obvious that she's on your side. Yeah. Are you saying that he's just a mindless robot? I'm not sure. But he seems intent on I have become my robot. We'll meet again. <laughs> I am a cyborg ninja. I am. <laughs> I gotta watch Futurama again. Yeah. I'd rather not. You gotta watch It's Always Sunny before you watch. Maybe that's what he wants. Same. <laughs> that's an order. 
Sir, yes, sir. Private, I'll knock. You're gonna stay in there. <laughs> Are you one of them? <laughs> no, I'm not. I always work alone. Alone? Fly home, buddy. I work alone. <laughs> Come on, get out. Why? <laughs> I thought you liked to work alone. <laughs> <sighs> I like that he's got kind of big hair in this game. Anakin? Yeah. I like his portrait. He's, yeah. He's like... I don't know. He's, he looks pretty disheveled. Yeah. He's exhausted. He's a fucking tired scientist. <laughs> oh, so you oh, so you are Hell Emmerich. Sorry, Hell Emmerich. No. There's something that I've got to do for Hell Emmerich, are you? Oh. Well, at least you're not one of them. He's got a limp in this game. He fucking like okay. sprained his ankle or something. Oh, he twisted his ankle. <laughs> but that's a, but the, the, that's a cool dynamic because like Otacon is so so shrimpy and, and frail, and Snake is literally the exact opposite. You know, he's a fucking mm -hmm. gruff hero and buff and yeah. awesome. But they two they become friends and they're like fucking partners and they... Whoa. Whoa. I don't remember that, that line delivery is crazy. Fucking <laughs> Deathmobile. What are you talking about? Would you operate the Deathmobile? Yes. <laughs> If you're working for a top secret science company <laughs> and they reveal to you, we are developing the Deathmobile and you are going to be our first test subject. You are going to get to uh, drive the Deathmobile. I get to drive it? Yeah. That's better than being outside of it while it's being driven. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't know why I said test subject. You're the, you're the, test, you're the tester. In the control unit. Not the testee. Testees. Testies nuts. No. Again, a uh, what? The armament was built Wait. By a separate department. <laughs> 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 that's just, that's just bald balls. <laughs> Testies nuts against your balls. Testies nuts and see if there's lumps, please. A laser and a please. <laughs> I'm very I'm scared. I, <laughs> I'm coming in for my my um my regular checkup. Yeah. Oh, real oh, good. Oh, Otacon's a geek, dude. I don't care about what he's saying. It's Japanimation. It's Japanimation. It's just Japan. like one of those Japanese animals. Oh, I get it. He's an otaku. Oh, so... <laughs> something that, that I didn't like from 3 was... Can you remember Granin? Mm -hmm. The he fuck and he fucking designed Rex. I think that's so stupid. You think so? I hate that. Because it takes away... It takes away from Otacon, like... I don't know, like him being as smart of a scientist as he is, because because it, yeah. no, he just basically all. stole if designs from someone else. Like they're not they're not his. Maybe, but I think that there's. I don't know if he designed. I don't know if Granin so much designed Metal Gear rather than like prototyped it and kind of sketched it out, you know, and and then it was up to Otacon in order to bring it to fruition. I mean, right? yeah, I, I, and it, and I, I still don't like that, though. I, that's fair, but I will say it's not entirely unreasonable for Otacon to get those uh, schematics and whatnot, because there's a photo of Granin and Otacon's dad together, so maybe he got it through him somehow. I don't know. Um... These are some of the super I don't know. I think I think it's more interesting for this to be like Otacon's own like idea, his own I, sure. I guess vision in like yeah. a kind of fucked up way. Yeah, I, I I think that Metal Gear Solid One on its own is a better story than uh, when it's contextualized. Yeah, it doesn't really it doesn't really fit in no. like at all in the in the grand scheme of the story. Mm -hmm. Like if you play if you play like three Peace Walker five. I guess Metal Gear One and Two, and then this, it like, it just it yeah. just doesn't it just doesn't, doesn't quite work. Yeah, it's know? a shame that everything else is built up around it. My grandfather was yeah. The Manhattan Project. I think I think Two does a really cool thing with being a sequel, but it also kind of, I don't I don't think it necessitated Three being a prequel. No, but like, I don't know. I guess, I guess, I guess, having three exist is neat, though. Mm -hmm. And they were like, oh, we kind of have to explain some of the weird stuff that we came up with for two. But we're also going to make a cool story as well. 
And it's like, okay, <laughs> good enough. <laughs> good enough for me. This game's all about genes, huh? Was it you that told me that, like, or I might have found it out through, like, a YouTube video or something, but, like, nuclear bombs don't have the risk of a nuclear fallout anymore after they're detonated? Like, leftover radiation? What do you mean by anymore? Like bombs that like we're developing these days, they don't they don't do it like like they don't leave um, like nuclear radiation behind when they, after they de detonate. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I no, I no, that definitely was not me uh, who told you that because yeah. this is the first time that I'm hearing. Um, but that's but that's interesting, isn't it? Yeah, it's just the blast. Because you know you have you have like those stories of all the like the people who were testing testing out nukes during the Cold War mm -hmm. and like they all got cancer and died basically. Mm -hmm. um, and it's like great. I'm glad we're still developing nukes, but we finally figured out how to not give people cancer by just testing them. Yeah, we didn't drop a single one on anyone during the during the Cold War, but we sure as hell killed a lot of people by developing them. Yeah. <laughs> On that leg of yours, you'll just slow me down. You'll need me if you're gonna destroy Rex. I don't need you. I just need your brain. <laughs> oh, I got you. you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he unscrews the top of his head like. <laughs> <laughs> if you get and then Snake just has that reaction where he just kind of looks at him, just like watches. He's not like disgusted. He's yeah. just like, hmm. <laughs> okay. There's lots that happen. He just takes his brain and goes, "Thanks." Cool, to thank you. Somewhere and keep me informed. You know this place well, don't you? Of course I do. And don't worry, I've got this. Where'd he go? Same stealth technology. It's a great effect. Yeah. Sound was gonna use them, but with this I'll be Especially for PS1. Bad leg and all. I wonder how they do it. Good. But I want Meryl to watch I wonder. I wonder if they just like displace the the like the background or something. Yeah. And it's still, it's still kind of frustrating, you know, in modern games, they're like, oh, we're not gonna make this mirror have a reflection because we're fucking lazy. Yeah. When they do effects like that yeah. for, like, a PS1 game where it's like, probably was not very easy to do an effect like that. It was yeah. probably quite difficult. What did she look like? She, she was wearing the same green uniform as the terrorists. Green uniform? Green uniform and something else? She had a big butt, guys. She had such a cute way of walking. I guess she that's another. Her behind. You were really looking. Well, she's got a very cute behind. <laughs> Thanks, Atticon. Walking, huh? Okay, I guess there is some indication that that's that, that is relevant. Yeah. We'll have to contact her when she's alone, huh? There's only one place where we can be sure she's by herself. The ladies' bathroom. Where's that? Kind of funny that this facility has a ladies' bathroom to begin with. Well, I guess. I guess that makes sense. Sniper Wolf. Well, well, this, wait. Is, this was a military base before it was occupied oh. by Fox Hounds. So oh yeah, so yeah, there were just like normal, normal folks hanging around. Yeah. Cockshot. You're not in pain, are you? <laughs> you feel okay? Nothing bothering you? What's wrong? Getting all friendly all of a sudden. <laughs> Get the fuck away from me! Punches him in the face. Strange. <laughs> yeah, what's up with that? Everyone else I've saved suddenly dies. Mm. Your bad luck. Forget it, <laughs> I love him. He's great. Otakon. I think Otakon in this game especially is great. And Otaku's a guy like me who likes Japan animation. <laughs> Never mind. Japan is the first country to successfully make bipedal robots. This is some. I don't think this is real. Still the best in the field of robotics. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, this is that's footage from Police Knots. Yeah, yeah, but doesn't doesn't Japan have like theme theme parks where they have like um. Gundam. Mech, yeah, like Gundam mechs. I don't know. They like they don't. They, they obviously you don't pilot them, but like they are kind of like life size and gigantic. I'm not really sure. So that's all police hunts footage. Pretty sure. That's cool. When did that game come out? Early nineties. You're right. Because there's two of them. Pretty sure. Science has always thrived on war. I don't know a whole lot about police hunts. Destruction were created by scientists who wanted to be famous. That's all over now. I won't take part in murder anymore. Whatever. All I want to do is information. <laughs> sure. I know everything about this. Sure. Place. Ask me anything about Rex or about this place. Also, 
With this stealth camouflage, I can sneak in Stealth camouflage? need ammo or rations, just tell me and I'll bring them to you. Does he actually do that? I don't think so. I'll be honest. What a fucking liar. See you later. And he hmm. runs off. Okay, dude. He probably just he probably just hurt his ankle and then like I don't know. It just just hurt for a little bit and now he's fine. Oh yeah, he was running off he ran it off, didn't he? Thank you. Whoa! It's impenetrable. It's fucking explosion proof. That's awesome. It's it's like a Game Boy. Let's <laughs> yeah. fucking survive the Gulf War. Yeah. I have a picture of that Game Boy. Yeah. Can we see it? Yeah. Oh, I actually have a video of it playing Tetris. That you took? Yeah. Oh, really? You yeah. actually saw it? That's it's, cool. It's in, it's in New York. Um, oh. Did you, did you play on it? No, no, it's in, it's in like a, it's in like a case. Uh. -huh. But yeah. There it is. Oh, that's really cool. Um. It's Game Boy's, yeah, whatever. Um, but yeah, it was basically a fucking survived a war. And you can see it's playing Tetris. That's awesome. It's going dur, 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 it's like that screen's dur, a little dur, fucked. Dur, 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 dur. But isn't that like... Like, it's like the GameCube. Have you seen those videos where they're literally fucking like tossing GameCubes off buildings or, or, <laughs> or whatever? They're showing like how indestructible the GameCube was. It wasn't no. indestructible, but it was very... Was it Was it hardy? It was solid. It was a fucking solid, solid little cube. Was it really? I didn't know that. Um, and I, I don't know. I just miss when companies made good products. Yeah. Everything is just fucking shat out in plastic yeah, and plastic and worthless and shit now. now. Like, I think my my go-to thing, my go-to example is like, ow. Um, is like DVD cases. Yeah. What the fuck happened to DVD cases? Yeah. It's so stupid. They all suck now. Yeah. I, like, I remember I noticed how worthless DVD cases were as soon as I, um... When I got my my copy of The Amazing Spider-Man. Really? It, it was the, ooh. Um, it was the first... Yeah, that was the first DVD that came in like that, like, I don't know, I guess economy case? Or is like, oh, okay. oh it's, it saves on materials, I guess. Mm -hmm. But, like, if it saves on... You, you can save on materials, but, but also you don't have to make a worthless product. Yeah. You know? I, th I, think, I think that's bullshit. Yeah, it's unfortunate. And, like... I don't know. Amazon is whatever you can you can have your opinions on amazon but it's undeniable that i do indeed use it yeah for stuff but there's always the worry that the thing that i'm getting is not gonna survive the the trip right just because just because you never know how you never well, know dude, how it's treated first of all but you just never know like what material yeah it's actually gonna be made out of amazon never fucking uses boxes anymore everything is in bags it bugs me and it's like, is that actually saving on materials, though? No idea. Oh, that's gotta be her, right? Yeah. Hey, baby. Why don't you come with me? Oh, fuck yeah. Yo, yeah, some to see your panties. Your pantyhose. Mm -hmm. Oh, it kind of held you back there yeah. for a second. Don't move. Second time I've been able to sneak up on the legendary. Yes! 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 Mission accomplished. Yes! No way you Achievement can. unlocked. <laughs> what do you mean? Hey, men aren't allowed in here. I had no idea you were so feminine. <laughs> She's a woman <laughs> after all. <laughs> I love how she has gigantic biceps in this yeah, in this she, game. Even. She's fucking ripped, bro. Besides, it's a waste of time. That woman's built all right. Up, they gave me psychotherapy to destroy my. Little did she know Same that she would fall in love with that man. <laughs> Yeah, with poop pants. Fucking liquid poop all, with private mud butt. I learned. I learned that in the mil, like in the military. I think this is probably an obvious fact, but in the military, you don't get cool code names. Aww. You get fucking worthless names. So people go into the military. They're like, oh, I'm gonna be Maverick, or I'm gonna be like Shadow, or something like that. But no, I, I watched this video of a guy give his give his experience in the military, and his his platoon was like Harry Potter, like um, fluffy and like. Whiskers or something. Oh like they were, they were all just fucking terrible names. Huh. That like, sucks. And so Private Mudbutt would not be out of the question. 
You have to shit your pants one time and then you're probably gonna for the rest of your life. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battlefield. The only time I feel truly alive. Seeing other people die makes you feel alive, huh? You love war and don't want it to stop? Is it the same with all great soldiers throughout history? They're getting here serious right here. My codec was broken. That yeah. Shouldn't you just be happy we met up like this? How did you that, recognize me in disguise? This remind this reminds me of, of that video as well. So like, you like about me, it's huh? it's yeah. it seems really scary oh, to be First like a soldier who <laughs> um who comes back from their deployment just like I don't know the ex the experience of having a way of life there yeah. and then coming back to civilian life and it's like. No traumatizing. Yeah, that's so scary. So yeah, to me. To you, huh? I had a I had an uncle who Somebody's had something really, really, really terrible happen to him in war. There are two and ways. Uh, Either we destroy um, metal yeah, apparently the readjustment is, is really rough. Code. Um, you got the card getting out of prison right too. People say yeah. like if you're in prison for like 20 years. Yeah. People are like, yeah, Where what the, the fuck is a smartphone? Right. Like how would like how would they know? How would they keep up on current events? Must be somewhere. Because everyone, everyone around them is also in prison. Mm -hmm. um, what was I thinking of? Like this is not this, like my my experience isn't at all like like those like those people like convicts or um, what are they called soldiers? Jesus. Um, but like even in college, you're you're just like you you sit down and it's such like a commitment for like. You know, for me, it's like like f like five months at a time. Mm -hmm. You're just like that's kind of your life for five right. months, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then you're done for like a month, or you're done for like the summer, and you're just yeah. like you have to go back, and it's a very sudden uprooting. Yeah, you're just like adjustment. you're just like what the fuck do I do now? Yeah, it's like I have like I don't have anything to do anymore. Yeah, you have to find a job, and like unless you have one at the time, but like if some most people move back for a certain period of time, right? Yeah, yeah, it's like some like. Even if you're not like finished with college and you're just like you're just off for off for like the winter break or something mm -hmm. You come you come back home. and You're just like what the fuck do I do with myself now? Yeah, right Like you just you had something that would occupy your time every single basically waking moment of your day and then And then you don't have to do it anymore. It's like <laughs> What am I like? What am I supposed to do? Getting out of school was like that and out of high school, it was like that for me. Yeah. Because you, 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 uh, yeah. did you, you went to college the first year after you got out of high school? Like right away pretty much? I, I skipped a semester basically. A semester, yeah. Yeah. But, so yeah, you probably, I mean, even summer vacations like that too. If you're getting up every week and have a routine at a certain amount of time. Yeah, and it's just like, as, there are aspects of your lifestyle that just don't exist anymore once you're out of, out of school. Yeah. Even, even for a break. It's yeah. like you have free, you have free time. It's like what is free time? <laughs> you know? Free time's pretty cool. Not gonna lie. Come on, use my. It's not it's not impossible to find free time in in college, but like you do have to be very smart about it. Yeah, that's awesome. That's fucking so cool. <laughs> if we're gonna go to the north, we'll have to go through the commander's room on this floor. The overland route is blocked by glaciers. The door to the <laughs> he's like, okay. Level he's kind of got like a blank stare going on in this game. Something about like the bandana being slightly over his eyes. I do. Li yeah. I love how no one has eyes. Yeah. I love how everyone is just a texture, basically. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's try. Makes everybody look tired and a little dead, you know. I'll be point man. Which is likely because they're fucking soldiers in the war. This is the cra the craziest eighteen hours of these people's no lives. I bet. Yeah. What happened to the music? I'll keep a so they were playing the Make like the sure mantis ready, hymn okay? over the radio. I guess. <laughs> okay. I'll be point man. Stops. Thank you, Meryl. <clears throat> oh, I thought that was a six. Yep. This is the mantis hymn, isn't it? Yeah. This is this is one of the freakiest. Little signs. Oh, it hurts. What's wrong? <laughs> Don't come here, Snake. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Whoa. 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 Ow. Are you okay? I <laughs> do. Uh, what happened? Hello. I'm fine. 
Oop. <laughs> You ever notice how she has nipples? Yeah. Not yeah. that I'm looking. No, I'm not looking. It's <laughs> kind of hard to not notice <laughs> right with that one. Um, Mr. Foxhound, the commander is waiting. I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> um, huh? um, Door was close behind me. Um, Whoa. Whoa! I didn't know that happened. Whoa! Whoa! That was cool. That was freaky. And I'm freaked out. And I'm oh. scared. Mm -hmm. It's fucking gonna fucking kill you. Snake. Oh. Whoa. Oh, do you like me? <laughs> Whoa! I love I love the the bit in Matthew Matosis' video of this <laughs> game. Where, where he's like, this scene is really weird. Instead of instead of this, she should have said, and then it cuts out. Yeah. And <laughs> for like for, 10 seconds. Yeah. For an absurdly long time. Yeah. And then it cuts back in, and then take it and put it in. <laughs> yeah. I really like, he's like, that would have been a lot more interesting and sexy. Especially that part about the bandana. <laughs> <laughs> he's a fucking, oh, I love that. Meeting man. genius. Whoa, Jesus. Just kills her. Fuck yeah, dude. I love punching woman simulator. Ouch. Ow. <laughs> Whoa. That is so crazy. So... Maybe... Maybe the entire game we're seeing through someone else's eyes? Hmm? Huh? You. Wait, get your phone out. We gotta record. Oh shit, you're right. Now, I will show you why I am the most powerful practitioner of psychokinesis and telepathy in the world. Telepathy? Telepathy. No, there's no need for words, Snake. I'm psychopathic. Oh. This is no trick. <laughs> That's so cool. It's useless. <laughs> Wait, he's gonna do it. Oh, he's gotta do the the. Perhaps I should say your past. Oh. You are a very methodical man. Okay. Always kicks his tires before he leaves. Okay. I don't think I've ever gotten that one. Well suited to this stealth mission. Hey. Ah. We didn't die to any of the traps. Or a coward yet there it is. Still don't believe me. Now I'll read more deeply into Wonder if it I wonder what it'll pick up. I can see into your mind. You like Castlevania, don't you? Yes! Have played Castlevania on this PlayStation? You have not saved often. You have saved once. <laughs> I can read you like an open book. You still don't believe me? I will show you my psychokinetic power. Put your controller on the floor. Controllers on the floor. The floor. Oh boy. That's good. It's good, just like that. Now I will move your controller by the power of my will alone. Okay. Oh. 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 oh! 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 my god! What do you think now? It moved on its own! I'm fucking scared. Ooh. Anyway, fuck this guy. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> um, um, I, I think our game's broken. Hideo, huh? Hideo? Oh. Bless you. Oh, oh my fucking god. Sorry. Am I out of? Jeez. Oh, shit. So, I st I stopped playing. This is where this is where I got stuck when I first played this game because yeah. I could only emulate it. That was the only way I could play it. Yeah. Um, and my fucking my emulator for whatever reason just didn't work properly. Mm -hmm. And so I couldn't switch the controller port. Yep. 
I know if you shoot the masks, you're able to take them out normally. Yeah, apparently that that, that is a way to do it. But this fight is still tough as balls. Like yeah. I I don't I don't know. I'm just not used to it. I guess. You need to get a fucking ration. Oh shit. Ouch. Do you not, do you not have any? Oh yeah. Oh shit. Get down. Get down on your hands and knees. Can I not shoot when I'm laying down like this? Nah. I didn't know that. No. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> there was a shotgun in this game. Same. When? What was the first Metal Gear game with a shotgun? Three. Probably three. Yeah. Oh. Such a cool effect. I know. It's, it, it, it literally just, the screen goes black, that's all it does, but it's so cool. Oh! It's kind of one of those things that's gotten lost in translation over time. Because now, uh, you don't cycle through TV inputs. You just get a menu. And they're not displayed in green text in the top left. Yeah. Yeah. Did you have a, did you have a TV that did that? Yeah, I did. I had a fucking, my grandparents had a fucking giant Sony Wega. <laughs> like, dope ass, like, tons of fucking composite inputs and an HDMI port on it. Wow. And uh, they were like, it's too heavy, we're gonna throw it away. What? I was so pissed. I was so fucking mad. I was that like, that's a priceless fucking television. Yeah. yeah. I can't read. And it was like right at the heat, the height of when we were playing like melee and stuff. Nah. <laughs> Why? Why? I don't know. We had we had quite the Smash Bros. phase, didn't we? Yeah, we did. We played we played so much gosh dang Smash Bros, didn't we? Mm-hmm. Um Sometimes I miss it. Sometimes I do. Sometimes it's it's fun to it's fun to go back and play Smash Bros when you're not like obsessed with it. Yeah. So you can actually just play it for fun. Yeah, when you're playing it just as like a fun casual thing, it's way more enjoyable. And you don't play it every day. Yeah. Um how many hours do you think you have in Smash Bros Ultimate? Like 800. Um it was a lot. it was a fucking lot. All right. No, I'm in the mirror. It realm. cannot be. <laughs> Uka Uka is Uka free. Is free. No, oops, it cannot be. It cannot be. Why? Where you go? Okay. Oh boy. Okay. Um. Yep. I see. Okay. I see. Now. I see. Just fucking took a took a shelving unit to the face. God damn it, Snake! You know that steamed hams bit from. From Simpsons. Mm, Steamed yeah. Um, there's a part where, like, you know how throughout it, like, Skinner's giving explanations for the thing, and, uh, like, he believes it at first, and then he gets suspicious as it goes on. Yeah. Obviously. Ow. Um, during, like, the early part of it, when he's, like, giving explanations and he believes them, there's, there's one part where Skinner explains it, and the guy goes, ah, I see. And the delivery, the line delivery, for some reason, when he says, I see, it, stuck with me, <laughs> and is really funny to this day. <laughs> Mmm, steam Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, oh. call them steamed ham to fight the. Fight the <laughs> that was awesome. Did you punch him? <laughs> yeah. No way. Fucking <laughs> punched him 80 feet against the wall. That was badass. Colonel, your niece is going to be okay. Colonel. Colonel. Fucking why is it spelled like that? I watched a video about why. Meryl's brainwashing Do you remember? Off, right. <laughs> Good enough. Why did you go so far out of your way to save her? For Campbell's Because she's kind of cute. It's, because you like her. it's not that, that it's not that bad though. Do you know how British people pronounce the word lieutenant? Oh, really? Is it Since lieutenant? Nope. You so much. You'll like, never be able to guess. It's true that Snake has killed a lot of people. But that doesn't mean he doesn't have a Okay, heart. tell me. It's okay, lieutenant. Lieutenant. Right. Yeah. Where the fuck is the F? Beats me. <laughs> the strong man doesn't need to read the future. He makes his own. Perhaps so. Wow. No point. Yeah. Yeah. Ugh. 
It's so weird those like transitions, like those. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and this like th throbbing effect. Yeah. Yeah. Where? <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> it's like stop doing that. Stop. <laughs> ah, Jesus. Ah. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, could you read that I was gonna do that? <laughs> Fuck it. Fuck, fucking takes off the mask, burps in his face, puts it back on. <laughs> That's awful. <laughs> oh, gross. What the fuck, Meryl? Jesus, Meryl. ...that I peered into was stuffed with the same single object of obsession. That selfish and atavistic desire to pass on one seed it was enough to make me Jeans. sick. Every living thing on this planet Jeans, is to mindlessly pass Think about the genes. <laughs> we designed that way. And that's why there is war. I think his story is so cool. But you <laughs> you are different. Puts on the, the mask because of fucking Stops the mu the thoughts from like seeping into his head. Yep. We live in the moment. Live in the moment. Humans weren't designed to bring each other happiness. From the moment we're thrown into this world, we're fated to bring each other nothing but pain and misery. She's like, oh, God. The first person whose mind I dove into was my father's. I saw nothing but disgust and hatred for me in his heart. What a dick. My father died in childbirth. And he despised me for it. I thought my father was going to kill me. That's when my future disappeared. I lost my past as well. When I came to, the village was engulfed in flames. Are you saying that you burned your village down to bury your past? I see <laughs> that you have suffered the same trauma. I don't know why the... the I don't know why that was... <laughs> that line delivery. Yeah, just... It's the, just a weird line in general. Just, yeah. So, thanks, thanks, Snake. Yeah. Great observation. Yeah, he really just he really just repeats stuff yeah. that is like slightly confusing. Yeah. Just to just to clarify it. it happens in later games a lot and in Death Stranding it's the only type of communication that Sam has at all. Just repeats yeah. what they say. The way that it happens is it's like, Sam, have you heard of Thing? And he goes, Let him think. And the guy goes, "Yes, thing. Here's a brief explanation on thing." <laughs> and then that Sam goes, me nuts. "And then Sam goes, yeah, I remember thing. I dealt with that before, or some shit like that." <laughs> it's like it's literally for every single fucking conversation. Oh gosh. Compared to you, I would go bonkers. I'm not so bad. Ooh. <laughs> I read her mind as well, Merrill's. No, the other girl in this room. <laughs> you have a large place in your heart. A large place? <laughs> How large? <laughs> a large place. But I do not know if your futures lie together. Ooh. I have a last Should we start should we start thinking about my uh, mask. Put it back what, on. what what happens later? Like this. With with the uh, gold other Meryl? People's thoughts. With what? He's like the ending? Yeah. Die. Yeah, I don't know. I want to be by myself. I want to be left alone in my own world. I don't think I've ever seen the Otacon ending. For myself. I'll open the door for you. If you want to find your future, go through that door. <laughs>
Oh, man. Well, good thing you're dead. Let's go, Meryl. I like how Snake has respect for his enemies in this game. Mm -hmm. Like, he... He he sat down and listened to Mantis's final words yeah. when he could have just fucking shot him in the forehead and gotten it over with. Mm -hmm. I actually heard him out. But also, clearly, Mantis was changing at the end there too, like he was having some sort of realization. Yeah, people do crazy things when they're faced with death. Mm -hmm. Can I ask you something? What about what Mantis said? I was just wondering how large the problem now. Oh, no, nothing. Damn. So, tell me, Snake. How large? What's your name? Your real name. A name means nothing on the battlefield. How old are you? <laughs> old enough to know what death looks like. Any family? What a fucking dweeb. No, but I was raised by many people. <laughs> Is there anyone you like? I've never been interested in anyone else's life. So you are all alone. Just like Mantis said. Other people just complicate my life. I don't like to get involved. Jeez. You're a sad, lonely man. Hey. Come on. Let's go. God damn. God damn. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Wolf dogs. So much. I ride dog sleds. I'm a musher. Anyway. I don't like this I'll part of the wolf. game. Snake? Yeah, I don't really either. Everything's way too hard to see. And the and dog the dogs, dogs just fucking eat you dogs alive. Will just hit you. Yeah. You can never tell if you're missing something. Get a shit out of um, but I think I think I kind of know where to go though. Mm -hmm. Like this, like this part is very brief, but like you just you just have to find like find the, the right the right spot. And yeah, then, and it really feels good. like filler, doesn't it? I don't need no Sound dumb so dumb sog dungeon. It'd be it'd be better if the if the the dogs didn't attack you. Oops. Which it seems like he doesn't want to. Uh, Giddy. Dude, there's a cat down here. Dude, no way. Oh. Kid. Hey. Dude. Everybody stop getting distracted by the. Whoa! Oh, fucking like Jesus. Cutie. Ow. This is nice. They just damage boosted. <laughs> nice. Nope. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Right there? Is it here? There we go. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Let's see, like. It, it's not it's the, like it's not even that bad. You just have to find the right spot, but doing that is this kind of one kind of atrocious. I think bees on you. Oh, wait, what? Yeah. Snake. Or maybe you have to hit her first. I need you to get peed on so bad. <laughs> Pee on me. I think you have to hit her first. Can do this so I don't die. <laughs> Ow! Sorry, I'm. I, now, now put the box on. Sorry, I just I I can't help it. I you were just I just needed to punch you so bad. I don't fucking know, dude. Well, I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. <laughs> I definitely don't get it. <laughs> I get it. He has an epiphany. He's figured out the world. <laughs> Light bulb goes off. What if that happened whenever you had an idea? Hmm. Like you, like a little light bulb just appears on, on, like above you. And then you can see other people <laughs> getting mine. thoughts. I'll yeah. Do you know about Stay this? Back, okay? The radar know about what? Working. Since we can't use the mind detector either, leave it to me. Okay, I'm seeing it. Okay, seeing interesting. It. Yeah, very meticulous. Okay, then you go up. Oh, oh, okay, okay, yeah. Plan, yeah, okay. Very specific direction to go. 
Yeah. Must be it must be like okay. must be ordinance right still like in a big huge circle right there. Mm -hmm. Obviously can't just go directly to the right. Makes sense. No well directly to the right or can I show you? You're gonna go directly to the right, is that what you said? Well no, I no, I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna follow it. Oh yeah? Uh, yeah, I think Hold I think on. I think I know I think I know what like yeah, it it, may, it makes sense. Like no, I I get okay. it. I get what's yeah, going on. Yeah. Okay. Are don't walk. Impressed? Yeah. Well, a little bit. Don't walk into any of the mines. Only a little. You do make me a little horny. Okay, I got you. Wait a minute. That's not. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Meryl's fucking crazy. Oh. Oh Jesus. Oh, it's right down to our cooch. Oh! Oh my god. That was brutal. That would suck. And should we just leave her bleeding out for like 10 minutes? Ouch. Ouch. Yeah, that's brutal. And she's like, fucking let me die. I'm like, no. Merle. I guess. <laughs> Merle. You're a rookie after all. Don't worry, Merle. It's that actually looks like ketchup on the ground. Even I know that. It's the oldest trick in the book. It's like green too. It's kind of gross. <laughs> yeah, it's like pus. Merle, what you got in there? <laughs> Without spoiling House of the Dragon, there was a, a part in it where someone gets slashed in the leg. And then a guy goes up and sticks his fingers in it and like grabs the wound. <laughs> it's so brutal. I want to help you. Quiet down. Save your strength. Shut the fuck up. I was a fool. I wanted to be a soldier. But war is ugly. There's nothing glamorous about it. Snake, please save yourself. Go on living and don't give up on people. No, oh, Meryl. Don't forget me. You can hear him getting a call in the background. Yeah. From Colonel Campbell. Colonel Campbell. Campbell. Gosh, Colonel, leave me alone. Meryl. Oh my God. Damn. Snake, it's a trap. Oh, Snake, figured that out. Right on time, didn't you? <laughs> for you to go and help Meryl, so he can pick you off. He? Don't do it. Don't do it. Must be Sniper Wolf, Foxhound's best shooter. Oh. Snipers usually work in pairs, but this one's alone, huh? I know her. Her. She can work for hours, days, or weeks. What? It doesn't matter to her. A, a gorilla. A female soldier. Gorilla. So Forget Meryl. <laughs> Snake, can you see Wolf from where you are? There's nowhere to hide between here and the tower. She must be on the second floor of the tower. Whoa. If Wolf is in the communications tower, she can see you perfectly. It's the classic sniper's position. <laughs> Thanks, Colonel. Classic iconic sniper's weapon. position. Classic, <laughs> classic <laughs> iconic <laughs> sniper's advantage. <laughs> I'm gonna save Meryl, no matter what it takes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Thanks. What's wrong, Naomi? Nothing. He could hear her silence. I'm just surprised mm. you're willing to sacrifice yourself. You got the genes of a soldier, not a savior. You trying to say that I'm only interested in saving my own skin? I wouldn't go that far, but I don't know what the hell my genes look like, and I don't care. I operate on instinct. Like an animal? I'm going to save Meryl. Like a snake, if you will. Uh, okay. That an interesting point. Does he doesn't know that he's? I'm going to save Meryl for myself. I... Colonel, don't worry. Hmm. Snake's a weird guy. He is. I understand. Because I'm thinking, I'm sorry. like, he says, she says you've got the genes of a soldier. Does he know that he's, like, a weird science experiment thing person? I don't know. Well, gotta save Meryl. That's gonna be imperative. Um, but first, I gotta stop playing this game. <laughs> Enough of that. <laughs> Put that away. What, what, should we see what Meiling has to say? Going to save her? Oh, she's probably she's gonna be <laughs> If I step out there, I'm gonna get picked off, and who's gonna save Meryl then? 
I'm hoping that as long as I don't fall for it, they'll leave Meryl alive. So you're just going to leave Meryl alive? Isn't she gone when you come back? Don't they, like, grab her or something? Mm-hmm. Meryl understands, too. That's horrible. You're right. It is horrible. But that's war. That's war. <laughs> just gonna chalk it up to war's hell.